by Pizza Hut. Breaking news from Pizza Hut. Any medium pizza with any of your favorite toppings, now just 12 bucks. Yup, just $12 for any medium pizza. Order now on the Pizza Hut app or at PizzaHut.com. What a fun time of the year. Go look at the standings right now. Uh, only one game separating the Lakers from the uh, Pelicans who are sitting at the number uh, six or the number seven spot. They got the same record right now as the Sacramento Kings, even though the Kings have the tiebreaker. So every one of these last five games for the Lakers are so important. Next up is Lakers game day with John Ireland and Michael Thompson right here on the home of the Lakers. This is 710 ESPN. You've been listening to the Toyota Lakers Countdown. Presented by your Southern California Toyota dealers. We make it easy. Lakers Basketball. Presented by Morongo. Morongo Casino Resort and Spa. Good times. This is LeBron. The Lakers play here. Powered by ZipRecruiter. ZipRecruiter, the smartest way to hire. Try ZipRecruiter for free at ZipRecruiter.com slash LA. Driven by Subaru of Glendale, the number one volume Subaru dealer in America. Your next Subaru is waiting for you at Subaru of Glendale. Delivered by Pizza Hut. Breaking news from Pizza Hut. Introducing 30% off menu priced all medium and large pizzas. All your favorite Pizza Hut pizzas, 30% off. Find the deals page on the Pizza Hut app or at PizzaHut.com and order now. This is Lakers basketball. The purple and gold are back at home looking to stretch their winning streak to four in a row. Lakers and Cavaliers battle it out at Crypto.com. Lakers basketball is next. The biggest show on the radio. That's Mason in Ireland. Weekdays after Crab and Sleep. The only thing I haven't won that I do secretly covet. Yeah. Host of the year. Host the of Mandy's. the year. Oh, yeah. Are you going to campaign this year? As always, I will campaign for Mason and Ireland to be the show of the year. Yeah. Just, just go full Mason. Because I'm being super humble. Yeah. Go full Mason. You know what I think you need? You. And I don't want the embarrassment of losing. That's it. So that's I'm the not, problem. I'm not going to campaign and then have Sliwa win it. No. He won last year. He's, he did. He's, I think he's going to go back to back. That was one of my favorite moments. It was Momo reading off Alan Sleewa's name. It was name. great. Because hold I was on. so Everybody genuinely. hold on. <laughs> Just wait. Just wait. The host of the year. I can't believe this is happening. Oh, my God. I don't know what's going on. The ESPN LA Lakers Radio, Radio Network. Network. The ESPN LA Lakers Radio Network. This is Lakers game day. Hi, it's LeBron. Here, Lakers basketball tonight. Let's go. Let's go. Lakers basketball brought to you by Pick Your Part. Selling your vehicle is a slam dunk. Score big with Pick Your Part. The purple and gold are back at home, looking to stretch their winning streak to four in a row. Lakers and Cavaliers battle it out at crypto.com with former Lakers world champion Michael Thompson here's the voice of the Lakers John Ireland good afternoon Laker fans and welcome to crypto.com arena only five games left in the regular season for the Lakers three at home then two on the road LA has a back-to-back this weekend today against Cleveland tomorrow here against Minnesota The Lakers are the hottest team in the NBA right now. They've won eight of their last nine games. That's the good news. The bad news is they've been unable to climb out of the ninth seed in the West, but it's getting closer. After Sacramento lost last night in Boston, if the Lakers win today, they'd be a half game up on the Kings, but Sacramento has the tiebreaker, so they actually have to finish ahead of the Kings in order to finish ahead of them in the standings. We'll cover all that throughout the day. But, Michael Thompson, I've been waiting to ask you about this since the news broke. We have not been together on air since it happened. Since we've known each other, both of us, but especially you, have been beating the drum that Michael Cooper should be in the NBA Hall of Fame. And today it became official. It leaked out a couple of days ago, but the NBA confirmed it. Your former teammate, Michael Cooper, going into the Hall of Fame And I know you say it's about time. Yeah, it doesn't make me happy. It pisses me off. Can I say pisses on there? Sure. Because this is 20 years overdue. I don't understand why it took this long. The guy, Michael Cooper, was as integral to five championships with the Lakers as Magic, Worthy, and Kareem were. 
This guy was an all time, eight time all defensive player. Defensive player of the year one time. Larry Bird says the toughest competitor he ever played against. And it took him this long to finally get the recognition. Total disrespect and, and total unappreci un unappreciation for how good of how great a player he was. Okay, he didn't score 30 points a game. Didn't score 25 points a game. But there are other parts of the game that are just are as important, called rebound and defense, intric in integral parts of the game that you accomplish out there. And he always took on the toughest assignment and helped the Lakers win five championships and one of the most iconic teams that ever played in this game if you put up iconic teams in the Mount Rushmore uh, of basketball saw so Bill Russell Celtics will be able to so be the Showtime Lakers right next to it and Michael Cooper met as much of that success as Magic Kareem and Worthy did and to finally get this recognition nah doesn't impress me 20 25 years overdue well the good news is I, I don't disagree with what you said but the good news is He's alive and can enjoy right. it. You know, there's yeah. so many times they put somebody in the Hall of Fame after yep. they pass, and it's like, yeah, come now on, Now was man. the point. Yeah, exactly. But so. uh, but uh, it'll be a great day. I Better know, late than never is what they say, right? Right. And I know Magic and Worthy and Kareem and the other Laker Hall of Famers from that era are all going to be there. And we get to see 21. Now we'll be raised to the rafters here in Crypto.com Arena because the Lakers only retire Hall of Fame numbers. Right. And, and so uh, Maxwell Lewis... Start working on another number. <laughs> exactly. Because this will be the last year you're going to be allowed to wear. That's right. Number 21. Um, the other thing, Michael, before we turn our attention to today's game, I know you watched the Iowa-UConn oh, game yeah. last night. Oh, my goodness. So the most talked about thing in sports today is whether or not the officials should have called that foul with three seconds left for a moving screen on UConn. What would you think of the call? Yeah, the way they call screens now, not only in college, but in the NBA, you twitch on a screen now, and it's an offensive foul. So the fact that that call was uh, made doesn't surprise me. If you call it, like Stu Lance always says, if you call it in the first quarter, you call it in the fourth quarter, not just because the game is on the line. People complaining about it. Let's say, let's say, uh, uh, Beckers, Paige Beckers got the shot, was went up for the shot, and Caitlin Clark just brushed, barely brushed her elbow. It's a foul, right? Should that not be called? If that was the case, no, you got to call him. Strangely, and this will surprise you, Stu doesn't think they should have called it. Why? And his argument is moving screens is a call you could call every time if you wanted to. Yep, that's so true. So if you're not, what Stu said to me was, if you're not going to call that in the first quarter. But they do. You can't call it in the fourth. They didn't. They didn't call any moving screens last night. And then finally, late in the game, yeah. they started to call it. So I could see it either way, but I'm happy. I was rooting yeah, for Caitlin Yeah, exactly. Because I, I was I was so mad that Iowa put themselves in this situation because they had a nine-point lead, seven-point lead with a minute to go. Next thing you know, they could lose the game. I was like, I was so ticked off that they almost gave the game away. But anyway, tomorrow, Iowa's got no shot. <laughs> I disagree. And I, I hope I'm wrong. One dollar, my friend. You're on. Give, uh, me, give me the Hawkeyes. Oh, I hope I got to pay that dollar, but South Carolina, those girls They're are really just good. too rough and tough. They're really good. All right, when we come back, we'll get you ready for this game. Lakers, Cavs. It's a big one for both teams. You'll hear Michael's keys to the game, and then we'll rejoin you from Crypto.com Arena. Lakers and Cavs on the ESPN LA Lakers radio network. Your next Subaru is waiting for you at Subaru of Glendale. Check this out. Lease a brand new 2024 Subaru Forester Premium CVT for just $279 a month plus tax for 36 months. When at this payment, RH447140 MSRP 32035, 2899 due at signing. Call 888 855 6434 or check out Subaru of Glendale.net. On approved tier one credit through Subaru Motors Finance, no security deposit, 10,000 miles a year, model code RFF11. Hey guys, it's Cappy. Are you a healthy young man between the ages of 19 and 38 looking to make a difference in the world? Well, California Cryobank is seeking individuals to join their team by becoming a sperm donor. You can make up to $1,500 a month. If you're able to work in the U.S., you're eligible to apply. If you're ready to make a meaningful contribution and earn some extra cash along the way, visit spermbank.com to apply today. California Cryobank, helping make families' dreams come true, one donation at a time. Apply today at spermbank.com. Yes, I said spermbank.com. Lakers basketball. It's Michael Thompson's Toyota Keys to the Game. There are the keys for the nice game, Laker fans. And the Lakers putting on a show. Lakers basketball is brought to you by your Southern California Toyota dealers. We make it easy. Michael's Toyota Keys to the Game. 
the Cavaliers are in town, so no time for the Lakers to be Cavalier about their attitude about being home today. Cleveland's big on the front line, so the Lakers have to keep them off of Cleveland's offensive glass. you got to out-rebound the Cavs today. Now let's hear if the Lakers brought home their high percentage shooting from the road trip. Let's hear if they can make 50% of their shots today. And they got to slow down the Cavs' dynamic backcourt duo of Garland and Mitchell. Them boys are capable of combining for 60 points. Cannot let that happen today. You got to put the clamps on Cleveland today. At In-N-Out, our hamburgers are made with the highest quality ingredients. Made fresh and by hand. Made with a smile to put a smile on your face. Made for special occasions or no occasion at all. Made with gratitude for every customer we get to serve. Most of all, every hamburger, cheeseburger, and double-double is made to order just for you. I want to give a shout-out to all those people whose job it is to hire. You have one of the toughest jobs there is. Let's make it easier with our friends at ZipRecruiter. How? Once you push your job on ZipRecruiter, it gets sent out to over 100 top job sites so you reach more of the right people faster. In fact, four out of five employers who post on ZipRecruiter get a quality candidate within one day. And right now, you can try ZipRecruiter for free at ZipRecruiter.com slash LA. That's ZipRecruiter.com slash LA. ZipRecruiter, the smartest way to hire. Tip off is minutes away. You're listening to Lakers Game Day. Remember, everybody on the hit that ESPN like button, LA hit that Lakers subscribe button, Radio and Network. make sure Once again, you John vote. Ireland Who's going and Michael Thompson. Let me know. We're at Crypto.com Arena for the Lakers and the Cleveland Cavaliers. The Lakers are coming off of their most successful road trip this season, 5-1 and one over a 10-day stretch. L.A. had wins over Milwaukee, Memphis, Brooklyn, Toronto, and Washington. The only loss came to Indiana. Michael, what was your biggest takeaway from the trip? Well, they did what they were supposed to do, so I'm not impressed, Ireland. They, you know, when you are expected, no, no, when you are expected to win, you're supposed to win. Yeah, I know the other guys get paid, too, but the teams that was on that road trip, the only thought, team I thought they would lose would be Milwaukee, and they, they almost did, but, of course, I expected them to go 5-1. and one. You, They did what they were supposed to do. When you do what you're supposed to do in life, eh, that doesn't impress me. Okay, both LeBron and Anthony Davis have been their usual selves, but somebody who should receive more credit is D'Angelo Russell. On the road trip, Russell Michael became only the third player in NBA history to have 200 threes, 400 assists, all while shooting north of 40 from three. The other two guys who've ever done it, Steph Curry and Damian Lillard. Does Russell receive enough credit for the way he's played this season? No, he gets overlooked a lot because of the presence of Anthony Davis and LeBron on the team. And so a lot of people don't really mention him like they should. But, yeah, he's been playing great offensively, shooting the ball as well as anybody in the league the last couple of months. And he is being overlooked. And and maybe that suits him best because if he was getting too much attention, maybe he'd start feeling the pressure. So this way he's playing under the radar and because LeBron and AD command so much and demand so much attention from the media and from other players that maybe he likes flying uh, like a stealth fighter out there that nobody can detect. Yeah, that's actually a really good point. Um, let's talk about the Cavs. They've had a good season, but they've struggled lately. Cleveland's three and six over their last nine games, and they were hammered on Wednesday in Phoenix, 122 to 101. They'll play the Lakers today, the Clippers here tomorrow. Even though the Cavs have been slumping, they're just a game behind Milwaukee for the second best record in the East. They're led by Donovan Mitchell, and Michael and I love Mitchell. He's great. 27 points a game. He's averaging career high six assists, career high five rebounds. He's one of only three players in the entire NBA to be 25 points, five rebounds, five assists, and one steal. Shea Gilgis Alexander and Luca are the others. Michael, we've been a, a fan of Donovan Mitchell's for a long time. If you're the Lakers, how do you slow him down? Boy, he's a lot, lot like Anthony Edwards. you got to hope he's having an all-shooting night. He can create his own shot off the dribble. He can pull up and knock down threes. He gets to the basket. So the best thing you could possibly do with a guy as athletic and as skilled as Mitchell is, try to just keep him in front of you as best you can and try to make him to settle as many jump shots as possible because he can turn the corner and get to the basket as well as any guard in this game. All right, besides Mitchell, the Cavs have center Jared Allen, who's having a great season. Allen has scored in double figures. 63 times this season and he's averaging 16 a game on 63 percent shooting so he stays close to the basket he also has 11 rebounds a game that's 10th in the nba what's your opinion of jared allen well i like him he's a very un unassuming center 
Good shot blocker. Goes after rebounds. He can score inside with his little jump hooks, but uh, not required to get 20 a game. But just a very good, serviceable, close to all, even though he made the all-star game one time as a, as a substitute, as an alternate, he does play, uh, he knows his role and plays it very intelligently for the Cavs. Um, maybe the future star for Cleveland is Evan Mobley, who played one year at USC. Mobley's averaging... 16 points on 59% shooting and 10 rebounds a game. He has 20 double-doubles. Michael Mobley's only 22 years old. Last year, he was named first-team all-defense. You think he can be an all-star one day? Mobley? Yeah, yeah, he's got a chance. He's got a lot of skills. He has to be more assertive offensively because he has good touch. If he can get around 20 points a game, he'll be an all-star. So he's still young. What's he, 22? 22. Yeah, yeah, he's got a long way to go. But, yeah, he definitely has all-star skills. All right. Can the Lakers keep it rolling against the Cleveland Cavaliers? We'll find out next on the ESPN LA Lakers Radio Network. You've been listening to Lakers Game Day. Get closer to the Lakers. Lakers basketball on ESPN LA, driven by Subaru of Glendale, the number one volume Subaru dealer in California. Lakers basketball on the ESPN LA Lakers radio network. The biggest show on the radio. That's Mason in Ireland. Weekdays after crab and sleep. Now they are working on creating personal robots. Now, do you have any interest, Momo, in having a personal robot? So you're hitting me right in a vulnerable spot. Yep. Because I have a fear of Skynet and AI. Yeah, blah, blah, blah. But I also could That's really use say. somebody to help me with stuff. Like a personal assistant. Yeah. Yeah, I think I would love a personal robot. Yeah. Go pick up the dry cleaning personal robot. Run the vacuum personal robot. Take over my life and kill me later. Right, see, this is... Uh, <laughs> this is yeah. I'm telling you, b- just because James Cameron made Terminator, all of a sudden everybody is uh, uh, quoting Skynet and saying they're all coming to get us. When, meanwhile, robot. my personal assistant, Ipe, is going to be very helpful to me. <laughs> going with Ipe. Uh, his name is going to be Ipe. Steve Mason and John Ireland, Monday at 1 p.m. Mason and Ireland on 710 ESPN. There's a common misbelief today that to go further, you need to push yourself, that you need to give up any joy to continue your rigid routine, or you could try another way. Take some time to enjoy life, like having a Michelob Ultra with friends, because happiness is essential to living an exceptional life. Michelob Ultra, a refreshing and balanced flavor with only 2.6 carbs and 95 calories. It's only worth it if you enjoy it. Enjoy responsibly. Don't miss Trav and Slee. Back Monday morning at 10 a.m. It's the Mid-Morning Spectacular. Oh, I got roofied on Friday, I'm pretty sure. (laughs) Maybe, yeah. But we'll get to that later. So it's like, you know, you're afraid of being snatched. Same for DeMarco. Even though neither of you should be afraid, you're very tall, big men. Emily, you never know. I could be the ultimate prize. You you never know. Prize for who? Somebody yeah, that know. wants a, yeah. you know, wants to be a Susan's right Tyson. next to you, who you is Tyson. a you never know. woman. You Remember, everybody, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and make ESPN. sure you vote. Who's going to win tonight? Just as know. every point matters, every detail counts in our meticulously crafted vehicles. Experience luxury at the top of its game. Welcome to Cadillac of Beverly Hills, the number one Cadillac dealer in the Western region. For the third year in a row, come and check out the incredible selection of new and pre-owned vehicles today at our showroom, 8767 Wilshire Boulevard in Beverly Hills, and at CadillacBeverlyHills.com. Wednesday night, the Lakers closed out the East Coast road trip with a win over the Wizards. Lakers win it 125 to 120. And the Lakers finish this road trip 5 and 1. Today, the Purple and Gold return home to Crypto.com after winning five out of the six games on the road. The Lake Show welcomed the Cleveland Cavaliers to downtown LA in a Saturday matinee right now. This is LeBron. This is LeBron. It's AD. Lakers basketball is on the air. Presented by your Southern California Toyota dealers. We make it easy. With Lakers world champion Michael Thompson, here's John Ireland. Good afternoon, Laker fans, and welcome to Crypto.com Arena for the Lakers against the Cleveland Cavaliers. 
The Lakers are the hottest team in the NBA. They've won eight out of nine games. They're coming off of a five and one road trip. The West is starting to back up to them. And maybe their hope of getting out of the ninth spot is about to become a reality. But Michael, if it is, the Lakers have to do their part. I think if they go four and one over these last five, they get out of the nine. You agree? Oh yeah, no question about it. Four and one is definitely doable. And they will uh, climb up to eight and possibly even seven, depending on what uh, New Orleans and those teams in front of them do. But yeah, they definitely need to go four and one to get out of nine. And I think they can go five and zero. Oh. They really, if they really put their minds and their hearts into it. Five regular season games left today against Cleveland, tomorrow night here against Minnesota, Tuesday night here against the Warriors, and then they wrap up the regular season next weekend, Friday in Memphis, Sunday in New Orleans. That's the rest of the Lakers schedule, but it starts now with a game against the Cleveland Cavaliers. And we'll have the starting lineups, tip off, and all the play-by-play -play action next on the ESPN LA Lakers radio network. Breaking news from Pizza Hut for a limited time. Get any medium pizza with any of your favorite toppings for just 12 bucks. You choose pan, hand-tossed, or thin and crispy crust with any specialty recipe or pick your own. Up to 10 toppings. Anything you choose, any medium, still going to be $12 each. Want to go big? Upgrade to a large for just $2 more. Order now on the Pizza Hut app or at PizzaHut.com. Travis and Sliwa. All the way live from L.A. Live. Back Monday at 10 a.m. You got to understand, my motorcycle gang, the Pythons that, that you are a part of now, Code. Pythons. We're chill. We're just, we, all we want to do is ride motorcycles. We're not wearing bandanas? We, we can, no, we're definitely going to wear the uniform. Okay. <laughs> but we're going we're, we're gonna, to we're gonna be polite. We're going to follow the rules of the road. <laughs> We're, we're, we're going to get a Slurpee. <laughs> sure. Our insurance will be paid up. We're not going to cut anybody off. We're, we're going to get we're getting a big quarter bite at, at 7-Eleven. Yeah. Respect yeah. noise. Uh, you, noise ordinances. Yeah, no, noise ordinances. Yeah. <laughs> yes. We're going to go to Los Olivos. We're going to have a nice glass of wine. Then we're going to turn around and go home and get <laughs> and to bed at a reasonable gonna hour. Like a, it's going to be like a biker's banquet. You guys are going to win nicest bikers exactly. in California. Yeah. It's the Mid-Morning Spectacular. Don't miss Trav and Slee. Live from L.A. Live 710 ESPN. Accident or injury, call Jacob and Ronnie. Call Jacob. Hey, it's Mace. When I was in an accident, my friend Jacob was the first person I called. He should be your first call, too. Call Jacob, 844 24 Jacob, or visit calljacob.com. Call Jacob. The winds keep coming at George Chevrolet, Chevy Dealer of the Year for the sixth year in a row. Take advantage of great offers during the Dealer of the Year sales event. Going on now, you could drive home a new Silverado 1500 LT with low 2.9% APR financing for 72 months, plus a discount of $4,000. That's 4K off all Silverado 1500 models. Visit them off the 91 freeway in Bellflower or online at georgechevy.com. Offer available to well-qualified buyers and approved credit through GM Financial. Excludes Trail Boss and ZR2 trims. Offer ends 3 24 For details, call 866-949-4805. The fun way to drive home is with Sedano and Cap. I'll tell you, man, I don't feel so bad about, like, not knowing certain hip-hop artists because I'm old-school hip-hop, you know? I'm like, I'm like from, did you just snicker at me? <laughs> Sedano and Cap. Monday at 4 p.m. On 710 ESPN. John Ireland, Michael Thompson with you at Crypto.com Arena. Lakers and the Cleveland Cavaliers. Today's starting lineups are delivered by Pizza Hut. Now featuring any medium pizza with any of your favorite toppings for just 12 bucks. Yep, $12 for any medium pizza. Order now on the Pizza Hut app or at PizzaHut.com. First, for the visiting Cleveland Cavaliers. They will start at one forward, Max Struess. The other forward out of USC is Evan Mobley. The center is Jared Allen. At one guard, Darius Garland. And at the other, Donovan Mitchell. The head coach of the Cavs is J.B. Bickerstaff. For the home team, the Los Angeles Lakers. They will start at one guard, D'Angelo Russell. The other guard is Austin Reeves. The center is Anthony Davis. At one forward, Rui Hachimura. And at the other, 
LeBron James. The head coach of the Lakers is Darvin Ham. Our officials today, Josh Tibben, Aaron Smith, and John Butler. Our team is in place. The producer of Laker basketball on the radio is Michael Funches. And it takes two engineers to send our signal across the ESPN LA Laker radio network. Here at Crypto.com Arena is Jeffrey Starr. And back at our LA Live studios is Wilbert Flores. Lakers come into this game with a record of 44 and 33. The Cavs are actually a little bit better, 46 and 31. And Michael, if the Lakers want to continue their dream of climbing out of that ninth spot, right now they have the same record as Sacramento, who's in eighth, but the Kings have the tiebreaker. The Lakers are going to have to take care of business over these next five games, and that starts today. Yeah, they got a bunch of veterans on this team. LeBron's been there, done that so many times. Anthony Davis is a champion. And these other guys were up to the uh, Western Finals last year, so they should understand what's at stake and what they have to do. So it wasn't, wouldn't surprise me at all that the Lakers close the season out on a strong note, going 5-0 and or 4-1, and because these guys have all been there, done that, and no reason why they cannot do it again. It will not be easy today. Cleveland is trying to take advantage of the Milwaukee Bucks, Michael, sinking in the Eastern Conference standings. Over the last four days, the Bucks have lost three games, all the teams with losing records. And if Cleveland wins today, they catch Milwaukee. Of course, if the Lakers win today, they move into eighth, half game ahead of the Kings. So a lot on the line here today at Crypto.com Arena. This is the first end of a back-to-back -back for the Lakers, their last back-to-back -back of the season. They play today against Cleveland, then tomorrow night against a really good Minnesota team. Lakers actually have a winning record in both ends of the back-to-back, -back, the first game and the second game. So let's see if they can keep it going here tonight. Oh, you mean today? Today. I, keep, I do that out of habit. Yeah, they don't want to show up tonight. They'll miss the game. <laughs> yeah, I, hopefully somebody you know, told them. I think Sasha Vujicic comes up the, uh, look at it, looks, just looks, still looks like a male model. <laughs> I think they should start every game at 1230, even during the week. You know, just tell your boss you can't come to work that day because you got to go to a Laker game. I'm sure they would understand. All right, here we go. Lakers wearing their white uniforms with purple numbers and gold trim. Cleveland wearing, they call these uniforms, Michael, wine and gold. Boy, that looks like some cheap wine. I know <laughs> wine I drink has that and kind of color. Why don't we just call it maroon and gold? Yeah, that's exactly. Look like my Minnesota Golden Gopher colors. That's not a wine color unless you drink it. I guess if you're drinking some kind of cheap wine out of a convenience store. Boone's yeah. Farm. Yeah, something like that. But the wine I drink has a nice, rich burgundy color to it. All right. Let's, almost purplish. Let's see if the Lakers can keep it rolling coming off of that great five and one road trip. And like Michael mentioned, they were supposed to win most of those games, yeah. but still it's hard to go five and one on the road. That's the best road trip the Lakers had all season. They went four and two on the Grammy trip. So in both of their long trips this year, Michael, the Lakers played well. All right, Jared Allen, remember in the old movie Fletch, where he says Fletch 6'5 with the Afro 6'9. Yeah. That's Jared Allen. Jared Allen is 6'9, but with the Afro, he's about 7'1. Yeah, he's got he's still got the ABA uh, Afro from the Dr. J and Darnell Hillman days. Yeah, I looks like, like you at the University of Minnesota. Yeah, I had an Afro like that. Here we go. Lakers control the opening tip. Anthony Davis has got it right side to LeBron. Give it to D'Angelo Russell. Back to LeBron. Top of the key. LeBron being guarded by Evan Mobley. He gets the ball to D'Angelo Russell, five to shoot. Russell down the middle all the way. Teardrop in the lane, good. Two nothing Lakers and D'Angelo Russell continues his excellent play. Darius Garland with it. Moving right, Garland to Jared Allen. Right side, Donovan Mitchell. Mitchell in the corner, Evan Mobley for three. Good. Nice touch. 
It's going to be imperative how the Cavs play today with their backcourt. Their backcourt of Mitchell and Garland, they have to lead the way. Yeah, they, they might have to go north of 60 points. Yep. Cleveland's going to win this game. Here's LeBron barreling down the middle, turns in the paint, throws it away, stolen by Mitchell. Ahead to Darius Garland, lay it up and in. Cleveland leads 5 to Cleveland's length is going to be a problem for the Lakers. They got Mitchell, I mean, they got, uh, they got Mobley and, and Allen, Jared Allen. Yeah, long guys. D'Angelo Russell misses a three. Back comes Donovan Mitchell. Mitchell to the rim. Throws it outside to Mobley. Shoot that. Mobley driving toward the rim. Stolen by D'Angelo Russell ahead of LeBron. LeBron down the middle. Bounce pass. D'Lo lay it up and in. That was a perfect pass by LeBron. And it's 5-4. Cleveland by one. Here's Max Struess. Good three-point shooter. Dribbling left. Struess down the middle. Kicks it outside. Stolen by Anthony Davis. Back-to-back -back steals by the Lakers. Here's LeBron with the ball, flying to the rim, lays it up, in and a foul. He drove Michael through the entire Cleveland defense, drew a foul and reverse laid it in. And threw, threw that over Evan Mobley's uh, contest, contestant too. So that was contesting that shot. That was a good move by LeBron. Hennessy's the Lakers official sponsor. Never settle, never stop. Joy Hennessy responsibly. LeBron misses the free throw. That was the first foul on Evan Mobley, first team foul on the Cavs. Lakers six, Cavs five. Here's Evan Mobley with the ball behind the three-point line. Give it top of the key to Jared Allen. Allen almost threw it away again. Here is Garland, though. Got it, got to the rim, laid it in. Garland has as good of floaters as any guard in the game when he gets into the paint. Floating little shots over the top of defense, defenders. Cleveland seven, Lakers six. Here's Austin Reeves coming around a pick. Give it to LeBron, back to D'Angelo Russell. Russell throws it away. Stolen by Donovan Mitchell. Mitchell into the front court. Mitchell to the rim. Kicks it to Garland. Three-pointer by Darius. No good. Tip by Mobley, no good. Grabbed by Anthony Davis. Outlet to LeBron. Here come the Lakers up the right side. LeBron's got it. 360, spin to the rim. Can't finish. Rebound, grabbed by Evan Mobley to Jared Allen. Allen to Struess. Struess back to Jared Allen, lay it up and in. Cavs nine, Lakers six. Here's D'Angelo Russell into the front court. Russell to LeBron, left side. Give it to Hachimura for three, got it. He ties the game at nine. And back comes Cleveland the other way. Donovan Mitchell gives up a three, got it to Jared Allen. Blocked by A.D., but Allen picked up the block and laid it in. There's a heads-up play by Allen, who stayed with it. Cavs lead by two. Here is Austin Reeves on the right wing. Give it to Anthony Davis, now to LeBron. Three-pointer by LeBron, good. Lakers 12, Cavs 11. They get it to Donovan Mitchell. Mitchell, top of the key, Max Struess. Struess to Jared Allen, back to Struess on a handoff stolen by Anthony Davis, and now they call a kick on AD. Once again, you throw the ball off of a player's leg, unintentional, and they automatically call it. That's not a kick. Now, guys, it's a kick when a guy deliberately kicks his feet out. Yeah, just I don't understand that stupid call. And by the way, Michael, they've been making that since you were playing. They, any ball hits somebody's leg, they call it a kick. Here's Evan Mobley driving on LeBron. I think back in my days, if Scarlett throws up a three and knocks it from 30 feet out, I think back in my day, you literally had to throw your feet out there to get a kickball call. Yeah, they call it way too often. You're right. 14-12 Cleveland. Here's Austin Reeves dribbles through the whole Cavs defense and lays it in. Ties the game at 14. Here's Donovan Mitchell up the left side as we go inside eight minutes. Mitchell powers to the rim and in. He's going to overpower Russell if he gets him in the post. Like a fullback out there, like trying to guard Mar Marshawn Lynch. 16 14. Everybody, Cavs let's go, Lakers. Angelo Russell got it to Austin Reeves. Reeves to LeBron. Three pointer. No good. Rebound, Evan Mobley. Here comes Cleveland. R uh, Mitchell tried to throw it inside. The Lakers jumped the pass. Everybody, let's by go, Lakers. By Hachimura. Here's Russell. Down low to Davis, fouled hard by Donovan Mitchell, and AD will go to the line to shoot two. Take a basketball power by Zippy the smart way to hire. Here's Anthony Davis going to the free throw line. The other night in DC, he went 15 times to the free throw line, and he made all 15. 
See if he can keep that streak going. First one good. 16-15, Cleveland by one, but AD can tie it if he makes this free throw. And Michael, if he starts making all his free throws, it makes him an incredibly hard player to stop. Because most players can't guard him one-on-one. -on -one. And if all he has to do is get to the line and he's making them, it's a whole new dynamic. He makes both free throws here. Ties the game at 16 with 7.20 remaining in the first quarter. Here's Darius Garland. Give it Evan Mobley. Mobley to Max Struess. Struess on the left side. Top of the key, Jared Allen. Drop pass to Struess for three. No good. Rebound Hachimura. Lakers can retake the lead if they score here. We hit the seven-minute mark of the first quarter. LeBron down low to Reeves. Left-hand layup, good. 18-16, Lakers. Back comes Darius Garland the other way for the Cavs. Garland driving. Got the ball to Jared Allen. Blocked by Achimura. Taken away by H. D'Angelo Russell. Here's Russell into the front court. Kick it to Austin Reeves. Down low to LeBron. Lay it up and in. Timeout, Cleveland. Beautiful passing by the Lakers. Los Angeles 20. Cleveland 16. 6.36 to go. First quarter on the ESPN LA Lakers radio network. In the front, we'll take out that tree, install a new fence. You're gonna call 811, right? Isn't that just for excavators? No, dude. Calling 811 is for excavators, homeowners, contractors, anyone. Natural gas lines and other utilities can be buried anywhere. Call 811 two working days before any digging project to get all underground lines marked for free. Thanks, deep voiced narrator. You're welcome, dude. Brought to you by Southwest Gas. Play your perfect combination at Pachanga Resort Casino. This time, it's Baccarat with buddies. All day steam, sauna, massage, facials. Playing my perfect combination means a round of golf, followed by a round of beers. Dirty martinis, slots, and a soak at the four-acre pool. Room service and a gorgeous suite with a view. Yes! Whoever you are, you'll find more ways to escape and more ways to win at Pachanga Resort Casino, official Indian gaming sponsor of the Lakers. Experience the electrifying atmosphere of Lakers Games Live with Lakers Ticket Exchange. Powered by Ticketmaster. It's a hassle-free process. Simply visit Lakers.com slash Ticket Exchange. Find your game and seat location and then a spot to cheer on the purple and gold. Did you hit the like button? Come on, tickets. hit the like you button. Book with confidence. Subscribe to the peace Join of mind that comes with knowing your tickets are verified and secured by Ticketmaster. Visit Lakers.com slash Ticket Exchange and join us in cheering on the Lakers. At in and out we like to think of ourselves as the vintage muscle car of burgers. After all, both are handcrafted, made with an appreciation for every detail. One with the finest materials, the other with the freshest ingredients. And seeing either one brings a smile to your face. Muscle cars and double doubles are all American classics, and both are gone in seconds. This copyrighted broadcast of the National Basketball Association may not be retransmitted, reproduced, rebroadcast, or otherwise distributed or used in any form without the express written consent of the NBA. Look at fans. Go to LAX. Changes are going on. Log on to flylax.com. Lakers playing well. They lead 20 to 16 with 636 to go in the first quarter. Michael, they've made eight of 11 shots, 73%. And they also have seven assists on eight baskets, four of them by LeBron. Ball's moving very well on the offense. The Here Cavs. comes Cleveland. Cavs defense can't seem to keep up. Donovan Mitchell, top of the key to Jared Allen. They give it to Max Struess. Struess back to Mitchell behind the three-point line, right side. Mitchell one-on-one -on -one against Austin Reeves. Drives on Austin. Steps back. Shoots. Three-pointer. No good. Rebound. D'Angelo Russell. Here come the Lakers into the front court. Russell one-on-one -on -one against Karis LeVert, who has just checked in for the Cavs. Who's in, who's out, brought to you by In-N-Out Burger. That's what a hamburger's all about. Here's Russell to Rui. Three-pointer. No good. Rebound grabbed by LeVert. 
Here he comes into the front court. Levert up the right side. Now dribbles left. Levert down the middle all the way. Tried to throw it to Jared Allen. Got it to Allen, and he put it up and in. 20 to 18. Lakers by two. They get the ball to Austin Reeves. Right side behind the three-point line. Reeves dribbling. Alley-oop. Tolbron! Up the elevator and dumped right on top of Evan Mobley. Here comes Karis Levert back the other way. Levert to Jared Allen. Back to Levert. Levert dribbles left. Got it to Donovan Mitchell. Mitchell double team. LeBron got a hand on it. Michael, does it seem like the Lakers have got a hand on almost every pass today? Very active hands. They're paying attention and alert on defense, playing the passing lanes well, anticipating the Cavs making the extra pass. For the Lakers, Spencer Dinwiddie and Torian Prince in. Rui Hachimura and D'Angelo Russell out. Here's Donovan Mitchell to bring it in right in front of the Cavs bench. Brings it in to Karis LeVert. LeVert, three-pointer. No good. Rebound, Jared Allen, but he couldn't save it. LeBron's got it, and here come the Lakers, five on four. LeBron to Austin Reeves. Reeves puts a guy in the popcorn machine and then throws it. Torian Prince ends up with it. Prince to LeBron. LeBron behind the three-point line, left side lob into AD, put it up, no good, he missed it. He can't believe he missed it. Back comes Donovan Mitchell to Karis LeVert. Back to Mitchell, top of the key, dribbling left, down the middle, Jared Allen slam dunk. Twenty-two to twenty, Lakers by two. Here's LeBron into the front court. Four twenty-five remaining. Dinwiddie for three, in and out, no good. Back comes Cleveland with a chance to tie or take the lead. Karis LeVert's got it. LeVert driving down the middle into the paint. Eight footer in the lane, good. And we're tied at twenty-two. Four ten remaining in the first. Here comes Austin Reeves moving left. Reeves to Anthony Davis. Davis drives into the paint, elevates, foul, count of it goes, it goes. Anthony Davis, and he's still mad at himself, Michael, for missing that layup earlier, but this time he makes the shot and has a chance for an N1 here. I think the basketball driven by Southern California Toyota dealers. Check out the latest office at Southern California Toyota dealers or toyota.com. Sam Morrell checks into the game for Cleveland. Anthony Davis's free throw is good. He's made 18 in a row. And the Lakers lead 25-22. Here's Mitchell dribbling left. 20-footer by Donovan, no good. Rebound, Torian Prince. Here come the Lakers into the front court with the ball and a three-point lead. Anthony Davis has it, gives it to Austin Reeves. Reeves guarded by Donovan Mitchell. Reeves for three, no good. Rebound Jared Allen, outlet to Morrell, now got it to Mitchell. Mitchell down the middle, Mitchell all the way, kicks it to LeBert. Now to Joe Harris, or uh, George Niang driving, and he puts it up and in. Boy, Michael Niang looks like a guy who just got off his couch and started playing pickup. Looks like Travis Rogers out there. He sure does. Dad bod. <laughs> Here is Prince. Down the middle, drops it for Davis. 20-footer by AD, in and out, no good. Here comes Cleveland with a chance to retake the lead. Don't let, Travis, don't let Travis say I heard that. Karis LeVert lays it up and in, and Cleveland is in front. 26-25, 2.50 to go. First quarter. Here is Dean when he tried to throw it over the backboard, couldn't right, get it to go. Tried to draw a foul, the referee didn't call it. Here is Levert to Morrell. Morrell back to George Niang. Three pointer. Good. Dad bought or not. <laughs> Said, take that, you idiots. 29 25, Cleveland. Timeout, Lakers. 2.35 to go, first quarter. Travis Rogers can shoot. On the ESPN LA Lakers radio network. Here in California, we are all about chill. From hitting the beach or going on your favorite hike to going all out and pulling for our teams to win another championship. No one is more chill than us. 
One thing, though, that ties us all together, enjoying all that California has to offer with great friends and a cold Coors Light. Pick up icy cold Coors Light today or even get it delivered to your door today. Visit CHOOSECHILL.com to learn more. 2024 Coors Brewing Company, Golden, Colorado. Celebrate responsibly. Now you can dominate the trail like never before. The all-new Toyota Tacoma is here. Lean in to its awesome power and legendary capabilities. Stand out with its aggressive look. Push for more, whether you choose the 8-speed automatic or 6-speed manual. All new Tacomas are available now at your Toyota dealer. We make it easy. Toyota, let's go places. It's easy to buy or lease any new Toyota and easy to own one. Every new Toyota comes with Toyota Care no-cost maintenance. You're covered for all normal factory scheduled service for two years or 25,000 miles, whichever comes first. Performed by certified technicians using genuine Toyota parts. See your dealer for Toyota Care details and exclusions. Valid only in the continental U.S. and Alaska. We make it easy on you. Toyota, let's go places. A cabana and free play? For booking a room? Don't say anything or they'll sell out. Now your top reasons to visit Morongo. Book your Canyon View room now and get a Lazy River Cabana and 20 bucks in free play Monday through Thursday based on availability. Number two. Get a folding insulated cooler stool when you earn 500 points on your rewards card tonight. And the number one reason. R&B artists Drew Hill and Montel Jordan. Live April 19th. Morongo. Good times. Don't miss Travis Lee. Live from LA Live. You know what never goes away? Talent? Jumpers. <laughs> Where that's us for pickleball. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see. Back Monday morning at 10 a.m. on 710 ESPN. Let's pause 10 seconds for station identification and the ESPN LA Lakers radio network. All right, Lakers have the ball. They trail by four, 29-25. Anthony Davis to the rim is fouled. And the foul's on Evan Mobley, Michael. That's two on him. And he might have to come out. Especially if he's going to be guarding Davis. They could go right at him. He's going to have to play token defense because Davis will definitely be capable of drawing a third foul on him. But the basketball is sponsored by Vista Paint. For over 65 years, it's your home for factory direct high quality paint products. Your championship team of paint professionals for over 65 years. Free throw by Anthony Davis is good. 19 in a row for AD. What's the record for consecutive free throws before a miss, you know? I think it's 93. 97, I think it is, by Michael Williams of the Denver Nuggets way back in the 97, 80s. Huh? I think that's what it is. No one's ever hit 100 in a row. Mike, free throw Mike, is good. Michael Funches will look it up for us, our producer who's sitting next to us and taking up unnecessary space. <laughs> Here's Evan Mobley with the ball. He made both free throws in the Lakers trail by two. He'll look up that record. Here is Karis LeVert all the way to the rim and in. LeVert is very good at creating shots off the dribble as we've heard now in two possessions for the Cavs. Here is D'Angelo Russell moving right. 20 footer by Dito. Good. It was no, it's a three. He stepped behind the line. So that means 31 30 Cleveland. Here is Morell, three-pointer, no good. Grabbed by Torian Prince. Prince driving. They get the ball to Prince. He's still driving, and now they steal it. Karis LeVert tried to run ahead of the game, and D'Angelo Russell beat him to it like a free safety. Here's Gabe Vincent coming the other way. Got it to Prince, three-pointer, good! Heads up play by the Lakers who are now back in front. 33-31. Here comes 
Darius Gar or, uh, Garland with the ball right. He dribbles, turns, shoots, 10 foot follow away, no good. Rebound, Anthony Davis. Davis into the front court. 45 seconds to go in the quarter, and what do they call a blocking foul on Darius Garland? That's a fifth team foul on the Cavs. It'll send AD back to the free throw line. Kids eat free at Wabu Grill. Bring your kids in for a free chicken or tofu mini bowl with any entree purchase eight days after four o'clock and all day on weekends. All right, let's see if Davis can keep this free throw streak going. He's made 20 in a row. Well, he's got uh, the record is 97 in a row by Michael Williams. So he is, uh, what was that, 77, 76 away, 78 away. Ah, oh, we jinxed him. Oh, you jinxed him, Wells. You love to start a new streak. That's the first we miss. Here's former Laker Tristan Thompson checking into the game for Evan Mobley. He's been in and out of his league more than any other player for a while. He was unemployed. Now he's back. How old is Tristan now? About 34, 35? He can't be that old, right? I'm going to guess Tristan Thompson's 34. He's 33. Wow. So young. And yet he's been having a hard time staying in the league the last few years. Oh, AD missed them both. Wow. So he made 18 in a row and then missed two in a row. Tristan almost traveled. But he gets it to Darius Garland, and Garland brings it into the front court with 35 seconds remaining. Garland gets the ball to Niang. Niang. Hands it to Karis LeVert. Florian Prince all over LeVert. LeVert with three to shoot. LeVert beats everybody to the rim, but now he drew a foul late. And, and the Lakers are furious. Michael's sitting right behind where Jarvin Ham is walking. There's, Jam there's Jar uh, Jamison Winston walking on the uh, aisle right in front of us. James Winston, the quarterback? Yep, the quarterback. Well, the, uh, one guy that would recognize him is the guy that's sitting right behind Darvin. That's Sean McVay, the Rams head coach. You think Jameson's here as a backup to sign with the Rams? They already signed Jimmy Garoppolo for that job. Oh. You, you hear a lot of, you hear all that talking down there? This is the Lakers yelling at the refs for calling this foul. Karis LeVert makes the first free throw. Where's, where's uh, Jameson Winston these days? I know he's still backing up. Is he in Cleveland now, I think? I think he's signed with the Browns. So he's going to back up uh, Deshaun, Deshaun Watson. Watson. Yeah. It's a big guy. Well, look how yeah, big he gonna, is. He's holding, he's holding, I think it's his son. Might be his daughter. I can't tell. His son. Yeah. And, uh, and boy, he makes his son look like, <laughs> like he's carrying a loaf of bread. Yeah. Big man. I wouldn't want to try to sack him. Lavert makes both free throws. The shot clock is off, and the game is tied at 33. Here is D'Angelo Russell. Russell dribbling. Russell on the right side. Puts up a three. Good. Wow. Sam Morell was right in his face, Michael. And D'Lo buried the three anyway. Four seconds to go. Here's Levert for three to tie it. No good. And that's the end of the first quarter. Lakers 36, Cavs 33 on the ESPN LA Lakers radio network. Did you know that if you're an employer who's hiring, it's going to cost you an average of 4700 bucks per hire? If you're investing that much money, you want to get it right. That's why you got to check out ZipRecruiter. Over 3.8 million businesses have come to ZipRecruiter for their hiring needs, and so should you. Check this out. Four out of five employers who post on ZipRecruiter get a quality candidate within one day. Right now, you can try ZipRecruiter for free at ZipRecruiter.com slash LA. That's ZipRecruiter.com slash LA. ZipRecruiter, the smartest way to hire. Everyone knows Earl Hershiser has won numerous awards for his performance on the field. But off the field, he's a great humanitarian, a true friend and partner of mine, and a real bulldog when it comes to business. Baseball taught me to work hard and respect people. But Tolo Chevrolet does both, and that's why I joined the team. Did you hit the like but button? Tolo Chevrolet Come has on, been hit the like button and years. subscribe to Coral, join the family. something about winning. I believe they call that a dynasty. Come see what the fun is all about at Rotolo Chevrolet. It's time for a Lakers game break. Here's Beto Duran. Matinee basketball in downtown L.A. Lakers on top of the Cavs, 36-33. Good back and forth action. Both teams running. Lakers with nine fast break points. One thing that you like right now is the way that LeBron James has started the first quarter. Very active. LeBron with nine points, four assists. Lakers are led by DeAndre Russell with his ten points. Uh, Anthony Davis has seven. Austin Reeves 
four, and Rui Hachimura with three. Lakers starters uh, doing well for them in the first quarter. Lakers shooting 59% from the field, five for 10 from the three-point line. D'Angelo knocking down two of those. For the Cavs, Spider Mitchell with only two points, one to three from the field. Uh, Carl LeVert leads it with eight, uh, along with Jared Allen with eight. End of the first quarter, Lakers on top of the Cavs, 36-33 on the ESPN LA Lakers Radio Network. John Ireland, Michael Thompson with you at Crypto.com Arena. Lakers 36, Cavs 33. It's the start of the second quarter driven by Cadillac of Beverly Hills. Experience luxury at the top of its game. Cadillac of Beverly Hills. The Lakers send out Torian Prince, Jackson Hayes, Gabe Vincent, D'Angelo Russell, and LeBron. Here is a steal by Torian Prince. Here he comes, one on two. Got it right by Mobley and lays it in. That's an all first team defensive player, Michael, that he took it right past. Well, Mobley cuts the challenge because he's got two fouls. Here is Darius Garland. Throws the ball to George Niang. Now to Morrell. Sam Morrell, three pointer, no good. Rebound, grabbed down low by Marcus Morris, who just joined the Cavs last month. Morris. Dribbling, turnaround, 15-footer, no good. Rebound, Torian Prince. Lakers have a five-point lead and the ball. Here's LeBron flying down the middle. Back, uh, behind the back pass to Russell for three, and he buries it. Here's Garland, moving left. Kicks the ball over to Morrell. Back to Garland, top of the key. Darius goes to Morrell, right side. Morrell bounce pass, Evan Mobley spins left, right hand jump hook, no good, that's his off hand. Here comes LeBron the other way with the ball. Lakers have their biggest lead of the game, eight points. LeBron right down Main Street, lay it up and in. 10 point lead for the Lakers, 43-33. Here is Marcus Morris driving on Torian Prince. Eight foot follow. Uh, good. Nice shot. Just kind of overpowered it. Here comes Russell. Moving right. Throws the ball to Gabe Vincent. Vincent tried to get it out to the corner to Prince, but the Cavs knock it out of bounds. It'll be Laker ball with 13 seconds on the shot clock. 43-35, Lakers by eight. Here is LeBron. One-on-one -on -one against Devin Mobley. LeBron back and Mobley in. Bounce pass to Russell, lay it up and in. How did LeBron even see him? Sixth assist of the game for LeBron to go along with 11 points. Darius Garland blocked by Jackson Hayes, controlled by Hayes. Now Hayes brings it himself into the front court to LeBron, to Prince for three. Good again. Timeout Cleveland. The Lakers blitz the Cavs on a 12-2 run. 48-35, L.A., 9.48 to go, second quarter on the ESPN L.A. Lakers radio network. This is John Ireland. You know BBGo. You see their logo on every Lakers jersey. But did you know BBGo is the official game day snack of the Lakers? BBGo promises bold, authentic Korean flavor. And if you're tired of the same old snacks while watching the game, try America's favorite and number one Asian snack brand. You can find BBGo products in the freezer section. Try the steamed dumplings or the mandu. BBGo knows that food brings people together, just like the purple and gold. Try BBGo today. Breaking news from Pizza Hut for a limited time. Get any medium pizza with any of your favorite toppings for just 12 bucks. You choose pan, hand-tossed, or thin and crispy Everybody crust with any specialty Lakers. recipe or pick your own. Up to 10 toppings. Anything you choose, any medium, still going to be $12 each. Want to go big? Upgrade to a large for just like $2 button? more. Come on, Order now the on the like Pizza Hut app or at PizzaHut.com. Join the family.
When it comes to interiors, Hyundai models have serious game. I'll be the judge of that. I'm in high-end real estate. I know a good interior when I see one. Well, for starters, we offer first-class features like Android Auto, which you can play in the available Bose premium audio system. Hmm, like whole house audio. Very high-end. We added available heated front and rear seats. Even the steering wheel heats up. Comfort is big right now. Also, it's flooded with natural light in here. And it's got modern conveniences, too, like available wireless device charging. Open layout, upscale amenities, exquisite driving experience. I could have this under contract in 15 minutes with a one-hour closing. Um, let me work up the numbers and get back to you. It's your journey. Own every mile. Right now, for a limited time only, get up to $12.50 retail bonus cash on a Hyundai Tucson. Visit your local Hyundai dealer today. Offers end April 30th. Call 562-314-4603 for complete offer details. The fun way to drive home is with Sedano and Cap. I'll tell you, man, I don't feel so bad about, like, not knowing certain hip-hop artists because I'm old-school hip-hop, you know? I'm like, I'm like from, did you just snicker at me? <laughs> Sedano and Monday at 4 p.m. on 710 ESPN. Lakers, Comerica Bank, helping students in the community build fundamental math skills. It's part of the NBA Math Hoops program. For information, log on to Lakers.com. Crowd singing happy birthday to Spencer Dinwiddie. How old is he? Turned 30 today. Here is Darius Garland. Left side to Marcus Morris. Back to Darius. Garland, top of the key to Morrell. He loses the ball. Got it to Garland now. And Darius is trying to shake the Angelo Russell. Shoots a three over him and it's an air ball. That was good defense by Russell. And the Lakers have the ball in a 13-point lead. Here's LeBron. Gives the ball to D'Angelo Russell. Russell, pass pass to LeBron. Out to Tarian Prince for three. Everything working for the Lakers. Who Michael are now 8 of 13 from three. 61% the shooting, 68% from the field. Playing in the afternoon agrees with the Lakers. Darius Garland for three, and he makes it. Micah, who, how would you describe Darian Garland's hair? Well, he's got uh, some, some dreadlocks that's tied up in a little bow up on top, so he's kind of cool looking. Yeah, I wish I would have had my hair like that when I was a player. <laughs> would have taken away from the puka shells. Here is, ooh, a steal by Garland. Good hands by Darius. He throws it outside to Morrell. Three-pointer, no good, but Garland's got the rebound. Down low, Marcus Morris. And he fouled. He's fouled by Gabe Vincent. I guess this Merrill guy is supposed to be a shooter, huh? Every time he catches it, he just shoots it. Over three so far. Michael, the, who you know, the opposite of that is opposite of that is Torian Prince. He's four for four in the game, three for three from three, and he has 11 points in nine minutes. The only guy to score off the bench for the Lakers so far. Here's Marcus Morris going to the free throw line. In and out. Always fresh, made to order, that in and out. That's what a hamburger is all about. Morris's free throw is no good. He's on his eighth team. Eighth team, wow. He's played for Houston, Phoenix, Detroit, Boston, the Knicks, the Clippers, the Sixers, and now the Cavs. And his brother, Markeith, has played in a lot of teams, too, I think. Including the Lakers, where he won a ring in 2020. I don't think Marcus has a ring, does he? No. They're identical twins, Marcus and Markeith. You know, Michael, they have identical tattoos, head to toe. And the big one says F-O-E, which stands for Family Over Everything. Here is Austin Reeves, the ball on the right wing. Reeves to Jackson Hayes. Hayes gets trapped, throws it to Russell, and Russell lost it. He was trying to whip it out to LeBron, but he lost the handle. And the ball went out of bounds. That's a turnover. Laker lead is 13, 51 to 38. Donovan Mitchell with it. Right side to George Niang. Niang to Karis LeBert. Ten-footer in the lane. No good. Rebound Austin Reeves. Eight minutes to go in the first half. Russell for three. Good again. The Lakers are 9 of 14 from three. This is 4 or 5. 64% from three. 
Here's Donovan Mitchell. Dribbling at the top of the key, got it to Marcus Morris. Morris on the right baseline, almost lost it. Throws it away, stolen by Jackson Hayes, picked up by Russell. Here come the Lakers. Russell to Hachimura, three for him, no good. Rebound, knocked out of bounds by Jackson Hayes. And here comes the birthday boy, Spencer Dinwiddie into the game. Why they taking Russell out? Well, what do you always say? They always take guys out who are hot. That just makes no sense. You want Din Dinwiddie in the game, sub him in for Rui. And now they bring the ball into Donovan Mitchell. Lakers are up 54 to 38 by 16. It's their largest lead of the game so far. Harris LeVert's got the ball, top of the key, moving right. Donovan Mitchell has it. Mitchell step back three. Good. Man, is he good. Not today. He's only got five points of two or four shooting. You know, Russell, Michael, to your point, has 18 points on seven of eight shooting, and they took him out. That's why it makes no sense. I don't get it. Here's Hachimura. I got to ask Darwin, so why do you guys take players out of games when they're hot? Well, it's not time to take them out. No, it's silly. Well, I learned from you, you don't get tired when you're hot. LeBron, he, oh, he, oh, he tried to throw a pass to Jackson Hayes, but Hayes had vacated. The Cavs touched it last. It'll be Laker ball, Michael, with .2 on the clock. What, so what's the play here? with point two. All you can do is throw it towards the rim and tap it like a volleyball style. Reeves tried it, didn't work. So it's a shot clock violation. Laker lead is 13. Reggie Evans scored And now they bring two. Russell back in and take out LeBron. So I'm not sure what happened there. It was time for LeBron to get his customary rest. Here is... Terrace LeVert puts up a runner, no good, got his own rebound and put it back up and in. And a whole lot more second chance points to catch it to the Lakers today. 54-43. Here is Anthony Davis. Right side to D'Angelo Russell, back to AD and the Cavs steal it. Back to back turnovers for the Lakers. Here comes Terrace LeVert. Leaves it for George Niang. Niang throws it into Jared Allen and they foul him. Let's see if this is a shooting foul. Nope, gonna take it side out of bounds. 6-10 remaining in the second quarter. Lakers 54, Cavs 43. They bring it into Max Struess. Struess back to George Niang. Niang driving on D'Angelo Russell, got to the rim and scores. That's a pretty good uh, I was gonna say, the minivan's got some moves. Yeah. Looks like a Ferrari just now. All right, can the Lakers hold on in these non-LeBron minutes? Their lead has been trimmed from 16 to nine. Here is Hachimura. What a ball to Russell, jeez, he's hot. Hachimura backing in Niang, 10 foot fall away, good, nice shot. Yeah, Michael, I don't know, if I was seven of eight, yeah. four of four from three, I'd want to touch the ball every time. Look at Donovan Mitchell to the rim and in. Boy, that was like a globetrotter move. Yeah, just brought the ball up around Austin Reeves' head and got around him. Laker lead is still nine. Anthony Davis, top of the key. Give him Russell. There you go. D'Angelo Russell's got it. Dribbling left. Russell, 10 footer. Good again. Russell now eight of uh, seven of eight from the field. No, eight or eight of nine. nine from the field, right? Mitchell for three. No good. Rebound. Hachimura. Got it to Anthony Davis. Davis will bring it himself into the front court. Laker lead is 11. We go inside five minutes, remaining in the second quarter. Anthony Davis to Spencer Dinwiddie to Austin Reeves, and Reeves travels. Turnover for the Lakers. They're eighth. Cleveland has seven, so both teams having trouble hanging on to the ball. Cavs okay, are taking the wrong guy out, taking out Neon and leaving Struess in. Struess hasn't done anything. The Yanks got given them seven points off the bench. And hasn't missed a shot yet, and they he, take him out. Here is Donovan Mitchell, and he got it down low to Karis LeVert. LeVert couldn't corral it, but he's got it now, and he's dribbling toward the basket. LeVert to Jared Allen, outside to Struess, three-pointer, no good. Rebound, D'Angelo Russell. Here come the Lakers with the ball and an 11-point lead. Russell for three. This guy can't miss. D'Angelo Russell. 
is nine of 10 from the field and five of six from three. Lakers lead by 14. Here's Mitchell. Down the middle, Jared Allen lay it up and in. Here is D'Angelo Russell, another three. No good this time, that was the heat check. Here is Karis LeVert into the front court. LeVert right side, Darius Garland. Garland driving towards the middle. Got there, beautiful move, blocked. Anthony Davis blocked Jared Allen. Here's Hachimura on a run out and they, they strip him. Here come the Cavs, length of the court pass. Jared Allen too far, another turnover. It's like a contest, Michael, to see who can turn it over the most. Eight for the Lakers, eight for the Cavs. Timeout, Cleveland. Lakers 61 and the Cavs 49. 338 remaining in the second quarter on the ESPN LA Lakers radio network. Lakers basketball is back. Kicks it to Austin Reeves. Three-pointer by Reeves. It's good! Austin Reeves with a dagger! The purple and gold on the journey to Banner 18. Look out! LeBron flying down the lane for a dunk. There I go. There I go. There I go. LeBron, AD, Austin Reeves, and a full cast of talent is a problem for the rest of the league. Vanderbilt volleyball to Russell, three pointer. What a night! D'Angelo Russell. The Lake Show is back in business as one of the top contenders in the West. So let's get down. And go. Did you hit the like button? On the Come ESPN on, hit LA the like Lakers button. Radio and Network. Subscribe to Join the family. Everybody to the left, go Lakers. Tap into all your game day news, Lakers Nation, with Lakers emails. Subscribe to Lakers emails for all your game day information to help prepare you for your Lakers experience. Receive the latest team and player news, player highlights, and receive updates on any promotions. Get ahead with our pregame essentials and be the first to know what to expect before every game day. Get all the information you need straight into your inbox. Visit Lakers.com slash emails and transform your game day experience now. Every moment of the Lakers happens here. LeBron is still dazzling the crowd. LeBron 360, reversed it on the other side, and laid it in. 21 NBA seasons, and the Kings stand strong in the purple and gold. Wow! LeBron and the Lakers play here. Just trying to make plays, and I uh, feel like that was the best way to kind of finish that one. On the ESPN LA Lakers radio network. Accident or injury, call Jacob and Ronnie, call Jacob. Hey, it's Mace. When I was in an accident, my friend Jacob was the first person I called. He should be your first call, too. Call Jacob, 844-24-JACOB, or visit calljacob.com. Call Jacob. Like a basketball. Delivered by Pizza Hut, featuring any medium pizza with your favorite toppings for $12. $12 for any medium pizza. Order at the Pizza Hut app or PizzaHut.com. All right, the Cavs have the ball, but the Lakers have a 61 to 49 lead, and their shooting has been excellent. Michael, they're shooting 66% from the field, the Lakers are, and 59% from three. And I said Cavs have the ball, I was wrong. Lakers have the ball, and they have the lead. Here is Anthony Davis to Austin Reeves. Got a Dinwiddie for three. No good, and it bounces up and over the backboard. Give that ball to the Cavs. They'll inbound it right in front of the Laker bench to Donovan Mitchell. Mitchell into the front court. Mitchell, top of the key, Jared Allen. Allen hands the ball to Darius Garland. Garland down the middle all the way, lay it up and in. Nice drive by Garland, and the Laker lead is 10. Which is a bad sign for the Lakers. It's great as they've been playing. Only up 10. Here is Austin Reeves right side. Reeves to Hachimura. Hachimura one on one against Karis LeVert. Goes right around LeVert. Jared Allen meets him at the rim and fouls it. 
And Atramora will go to the free throw line to shoot two. The basketball brought to you by Moraga Casino Resort and Spa. Good times. Hachimura to the free throw line. First one in and out, no good. So the Lakers started strong, but have, I think missed Everybody their last. Everybody, let's game. go Lakers. Five out of nine. Next, Did you hit the like button? Rui. Come on, hit the like no button. And subscribe too. So the Lakers Join have the hit family. a full streak from the free throw line and the lead remains 10. Here's Donovan Mitchell into the front court. 240 remaining in the first half. Darius Garland's got it. Garland turns, spins, kicks it in the corner. Struce has got it. Struce two-pointer. Good. Rolled around for a while, but finally dropped. Laker lead is eight. Here is Anthony Davis. Gets the ball to Spencer Dinwiddie, top of the key. Dinwiddie dribbling left. Dinwiddie all the way to the basket. Still dribbling, goes to Hachimura and out of Reeves. Reeves, three-pointer, no good. Rebound, LaBert. Approaching two minutes remaining in the first half. Darius Garland for three, and we got ourselves a new ball game now. 61-56. Lakers led by as many as 16. Now that lead down to just five. Here's Anthony Davis to Spencer Dinwiddie. Gets the ball to LeBron. LeBron. Holds the ball high over his head, backing in Max Struess. Lays it up, left-handed, and in. Beautiful move by LeBron. 63-56, minute and a half to go, second quarter. Lakers almost had a steal. Instead, Struess has got it and dribbles it off his foot out of bounds to the Lakers. Here comes D'Angelo Russell back in for the final 122 of the quarter. They bring the ball into Russell, into the front court. Got it to LeBron. He's being tackled. He goes back to AD who dunks it. Perfect pass from LeBron, who's up to nine assists. And we're still in the first half. Here is Darius Garland. Beautiful move. Hits a floater and misses it. Jared Allen misses. Ball goes to Allen. Hook pass to Struz. Now to LeVert. LeVert down the middle all the way. Blocked from behind by Russell and the Laker defense is excellent. 55 seconds remaining in the first half, 17 on the shot clock for Cleveland. Laker lead is nine, 65 56. And Anthony Davis is saying something about why is the shot clock at 17? They never hit the rim. And Josh Timmon is talking to the other officials. Hyundai and a half coming up. Drive that Hyundai you always want. Own every mile in a brand new Hyundai. Visit Hyundai.com or your SoCal Hyundai dealer. So they're going to adjust the shot clock here, Michael, because somebody reset it even though the Cavs never hit the rim. My guess is they're going to take eight or nine seconds off this. It's at 17 right now. Well, they only took two seconds off, down to 15. So that was a whole waste of time for nothing. Exactly. I mean, if nobody would even notice that these refs would have stopped the game. Coaches weren't complaining. Players didn't point it out. Over. I, I think the players did point it out. I think Anthony Davis said, over two seconds, come on. No, no, but he's now they're arguing that it should be under 10 seconds. And LeBron's arguing too. I mean, they they think this should be less than 10 seconds to shoot. And they're pretty adamant about it. And after all this, the Cavs are still gonna score. <laughs> ah, let's go, let's get the game going. Now they're gonna probably go over there and get a review and look at all, and talk now, about it some more. JV Bickerstaff wants to know what's going on. So you got Garland hitting the ball, hitting the rim. I wanted the ball hit the rim, so get the take, clock reset. The 104, it should have been 14. A reset to 14. So we're going to take 9 out of 14 and go to 5 on the shot clock. All right, so there it is. The Lakers win the argument. They put 5 seconds on the shot clock.
That's a little different than having 17 on the shot clock. Here's Karis LeVert to bring it in. And LeVert gets it into Struess, blocked by Davis, picked up by Struess, shoots a 12-footer behind the backboard, no good. Excellent defense by Anthony Davis. 50 seconds remaining. Laker lead is nine, 65-56. Here is D'Angelo Russell with it, top of the key, Austin Reeves. Back to Russell, into LeBron. LeBron, one-on-one -on -one against Jared Allen with 10 to shoot. LeBron at the left elbow, dribbles, goes right at Allen, fakes him out of his shorts, shoots a 10-footer, no good. Shot clock and the game clock are about five seconds apart. Here come the Cavs with 15 to shoot it. Donovan Mitchell's got it just inside half court. Mitchell dribbling. One on one against D'Angelo Russell, gets a three off, no good. Rebound Anthony Davis, seven seconds remaining in the half. Here comes Davis into the front court. Bounce pass, D'Angelo Russell, three pointer. No good, and that's halftime. Lakers 65, Cavs 56. Better Duran next. Everybody, on let's the go, Lakers. Lakers. Radio Network. Did you hit the like now button? Was a great time Come on, to visit hit the, the Carlos like Casino button. And hotel. Subscribe to seven miles Join south the of downtown LA, just off the five freeway. Come experience some of the best action that SoCal has to offer. There's always a seat at the table at LA's Commerce Casino with the widest variety of poker and table games around. From Easy Baccarat, Hold'em, 21st Century Blackjack, and many more. Commerce Casino is where the game reigns. Must be 21. Play responsibly. Gambling problem? Call 1-800-GAMBLER or visit problemgambling.ca.gov. Hey, it's Mace. Life may not always go as the playbook intended, but the L.A. County Department of Mental Health has got your back. If you ever feel anxious, overwhelmed, need immediate help, we're here for you with free emotional support, service referrals, and crisis counseling. Call our 24-7 helpline, 800-854-7771, or visit the Department of Mental Health website at dmh.lacounty.gov. Life is a team sport, and the L.A. County Department of Mental Health is here to support you every step of the way. Just as every point matters, every detail counts in our meticulously crafted vehicles. Experience luxury at the top of its game. Welcome to Cadillac of Beverly Hills, the number one Cadillac dealer in the Western region for the third year in a row. Come and check out the incredible selection of new and pre-owned vehicles today at our showroom, 8767 Wilshire Boulevard in Beverly Hills and at CadillacBeverlyHills.com. Travis and Sliwa. All the way live from L.A. Live. Back Monday at 10 a.m. It wasn't a thunderclap. It could have been upon further review because I was asleep. But usually thunderclaps are not singular. Usually right. they are multiple. Usually they're 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 pay extra for that. I've never heard. Yeah, you never heard thunderclap? Thunder no. Really? I've never heard that. Emily, I didn't make that up, did I? No, I, yeah. I just I don't refer to it typically that, but I've heard it. It's a term that's used for other things. What are you watching? If it's spoken out loud, it exists also don't search that. No, I can't. Trav, can I? Thunderclap. A clash of thunder used in similes to refer to something startling or unexpected. The invasion of the Falklands came as a thunderclap. Yeah, but you have, there's a link to that. Did you hit the like button? No, you maybe on oh, the hit the like maybe button. Maybe different websites. Subscribe to different, different Urban Dictionary. I'm going to Urban Dictionary. Right. Conspiracy. <laughs> it's the Mid-Morning Spectacular. Don't miss Travis Lee, live from LA Live. 710 ESPN. It's halftime of Lakers basketball. Time to recap the first half. Take a look at the stats and key plays. Hi, it's LeBron. The Lakers play here. Hi, this is Anthony Davis of your Los Angeles Lakers. This is your home for Lakers basketball. And what the Lake Show needs to do in the second half. This is Hyundai at the Half. The ESPN LA Lakers Radio Network. It's halftime of Lakers Cavaliers from Crypto.com. Game 78 of the season for the purple and gold. Driven by your Southern California Hyundai dealers. There's never been a better time to test drive that Hyundai you've always wanted. It's your journey. Own every mile in a brand new Hyundai. Visit buyhyundai.com or see your SoCal Hyundai dealer today. 
Now, here's Bethel Duran. Halftime at Crypto.com Arena. Matinee hoops and the Lakers are on top of the Cavaliers. 65 to 56. And the music you're hearing in the background, Red Panda is performing. She's the acrobat who tosses balls onto her head while on a unicycle. So you're going to hear a lot of oohs and ahs during this halftime update. Uh, Lakers looking pretty good. And it got going early on. LeBron James was alive early in the first quarter. They get the ball to Austin Reeves, right side behind the three-point line. Reeves dribbling, alley-oop to LeBron! Up the elevator and dumped right on top of Evan Mobley. LeBron with nine and four in the first quarter. That's big because he normally starts off slow in that first quarter. D'Angelo Russell and AD been looking really good. AD early. Reeves to Anthony Davis. Davis drives into the paint, elevates, foul, count of it goes, it goes. Anthony Davis, and he's still mad at himself, Michael, for missing that layup earlier, but this time he makes the shot and has a chance for an N1 here. And how about a D-Lo three? Here is D'Angelo Russell. Russell dribbling. Russell on the right side, puts up a three, good, wow. Sam Morell was right in his face, Michael, and D'Lo buried the three anyway. Oh, D'Lo looking good. At the end of the first quarter, Lakers were up by three, 36-33. Then they went on a 15-2 run to start the second quarter. D'Lo. Here is LeBron. One-on-one against Evan Mobley. LeBron back and Mobley in. Bounce pass to Russell, lay it up and in. How did LeBron even see him? Sixth assist of the game. For LeBron to go along with 11 points. More D Lo. Eight minutes to go in the first half. Russell for three. Good again. The Lakers are nine of 14 from three. So it's four or five. 64% from three. Lakers were looking really good in the first half. D'Angelo Russell with 23 points, five three pointers. But you know that Cleveland's going to battle back. Harris LeVert's got the ball, top of the key, moving right. Donovan Mitchell has it. Mitchell, step back three. Good. Man, is he good. Not today. He's only got five points and two or four shooting. He ends up with seven in the first half. So Cleveland was cutting into the lead. Lakers put him back. Rebound, D'Angelo Russell. Here come the Lakers with the ball and an 11-point lead. Russell for three. This guy can't miss. D'Angelo Russell is nine of 10 from the field and five of six from three. Lakers lead by 14. And the Lakers battle back and forth with Cleveland. How about another bucket to finish the quarter? They bring the ball into Russell, into the front court, got it to LeBron, he's being tackled. He goes back to AD who dunks it. Perfect pass from LeBron, who's up to nine assists and we're still in the first half. LeBron finishes with 13 and 9. And Red Panda gets the ovation. She threw all the bulls, landed on top of her head. She's still a future Hall of Famer, despite Michael Thompson shaking his head. No. Coming up, we'll give you MT's keys to the game. Lakers on top, 66-65-56 on the ESPN LA Lakers Radio Network. Earl Hershiser has won numerous awards for his performance on the field. But off the field, he's a great humanitarian, a true friend and partner of mine, and a real bulldog when it comes to business. Baseball taught me to work hard and respect people. Rotolo Chevrolet does both, and that's why I joined the team. Rotolo Chevrolet has been dealer of the year for 12 straight years. Like Earl, we know something about winning. I believe they call that a dynasty. Come see what the fun is all about at Rotolo Chevrolet. The NBA app is everyone's app. Every fan of every team. Oh my goodness. Everyone who follows LeBron, Tatum, and Embiid in the app. Every warrior who's ready to go to battle over three-point percentages. Every streetwear king who's here for the tunnel fits. Every young buck, nugget, and grizzly who wants to take a peek behind the scenes of the league. And everyone else. Remember everybody, hit that like button, corner. hit that subscribe button. Download the NBA Make app sure today. Available in the Google Play, Apple app, and Android stores. 
at the Los Angeles International Airport. Changes are arriving daily to reduce traffic, save travelers time, and transform the travel experience. The LAX economy parking structure is now open with thousands of smart parking spaces, as well as hundreds of electric vehicle charging stations. Modernized terminals have biometric gates for faster boarding. A new facility will have all major rental car brands under one roof. And soon the People Mover train will connect travelers to LA Metro. Info at flylax.com slash transforming LAX. At In-N-Out, our hamburgers are made with the highest quality ingredients. Made fresh and by hand. Made with a smile to put a smile on your face. Made for special occasions or no occasion at all. Made with gratitude for every customer we get to serve. Most of all, every hamburger, cheeseburger, and double-double is made to order just for you. Your home of Lakers basketball this season. Hachimura steals it. Falls on the ground. Picked up by Christian Wood. Outlet to LeBron. LeBron to Reeves. Reeves to the rim. Lakers lead. The ESPN LA Lakers Radio Network. It's halftime of Lakers basketball. This is Hyundai at the half. It's AD. It's halftime of Lakers basketball. <laughs> and at the half, Lakers on top, 65 to 56. Red Panda going for five bowls, trying to land it on her head. And she lands them all. She gets them all. Michael Thompson upset because he was rooting against a Red Panda. Right now, let's take a look back at Michael's keys to the game. The first key for MT was try to out-rebound Cleveland's big front line. Let's look at the first half uh, rebounding numbers. Lakers with 15 rebounds. The Cavs with 16. Offensive rebounds, nine offensive boards for the Cleveland Cavaliers. Four of them coming from Donovan Mitchell, the guard. Lakers with zero offensive rebounds. Uh, second is shoot at least 50% from the field. Lakers are listening to you, MT. Lakers shooting 61% from the field, 25 for 41. Big reason D'Angelo Russell going 9 for 12. LeBron 6 for 9. Rui Hachimura 2 for 5. AD and Reeves 2 for 4. And Torian Prince off of the bench, a perfect 4 for 4. Torian Prince, the only member of the Lakers bench squad that has scored. He has 11 points. Uh, Dinwiddie going 0 for 3. Gabe Vincent and Jackson Hayes with zero field goal attempts. And if you hit the like button, Mitchell and come Garland on, hit the like button. Combined. And subscribe too. Join the good family. To watch. And Donovan Mitchell is struggling. First half for Swider, three for seven, only seven points. He does have four assists. Garland isn't. Garland is hooping right now. 6'11 from the field, two three-pointers. He has 14 points. Uh, so, and he also has two steals. The Cavs shoot 46%, 31% from the field. Lakers at one point had a 16-point lead. It's now down to 9, 65-56. All right, that's been Michael Thompson's keys to the game. That's been Hyundai at the half. There's never been a better time to test drive that Hyundai you've always wanted. It's your journey. Own every mile in a brand-new Hyundai. Visit buyhyundai.com or see your SoCal Hyundai dealer. I'm Bethel Duran at the half. Lakers on the front end of a back-to-back -back, because tomorrow night there will be a 7 o'clock game. they got to take care of the Cavaliers of the three spot in the Eastern Conference. All the players on the floor right now getting loose for the second half. And once again, LeBron James, excellent play. He's 13 points, 9 assists. DeAndre Russell, 23 points, 4 assists. Lakers on top, 65-56. Coming up, the second half with John and Michael on the ESPN LA Lakers Radio Network. This is John Ireland. You know BBGo. You see their logo on every Lakers jersey. But did you know BBGo is the official game day snack of the Lakers? BBGo promises bold, authentic Korean flavor. And if you're tired of the same old snacks while watching the game, try America's favorite and number one Asian snack brand. You can find BBGo products in the freezer section. Try the steamed dumplings or the mandu. BBGo knows that food brings people together, just like the purple and gold. Try BBGo today. When it comes to interiors, Hyundai models have serious game. I'll be the judge of that. I'm in high-end real estate. I know a good interior when I see one. Well, for starters, we offer first-class features like Android Auto, which you can play in the available Bose premium audio system. Hmm, like whole house audio. Very high-end. We added available heated front and rear seats. Even the steering wheel heats up. Comfort is big right now. 
Also, it's flooded with natural light in here. And it's got modern conveniences, too, like available wireless device charging. Open layout, upscale amenities, exquisite driving experience. I could have this under contract in 15 minutes with a one-hour closing. Um, let me work up the numbers and get back to you. It's your journey. Own every mile. Right now, for a limited time only, get up to 1250 retail bonus cash on a Hyundai Tucson. Visit your local Hyundai dealer today. Offers end April 30th. Call 562-314-4603 for complete offer details. Sedano and Cap for your afternoon drive. The fun way to drive home on 710. I got your back, Cappy. Thank you, buddy. Oh, Appreciate yeah. Please, that. Please, if there's one guy that never has your back, Cappy, it's I just said it on the air. No, Live come on. Air. I got Cappy's back on this one. Okay. Oh, just on this one. Just on this one. I was very clear. <laughs> I got your back on this one. <laughs> That's what Otani probably said to his interpreter. Don't worry, bro. I got your back. I'll, I'll make those payments for you. Yeah. <laughs> the LA Afternoon Takeover with Sedano and Cap, Monday at 4 p.m. on 710 ESPN. <laughs> John Ireland, Michael Thompson with you at Crypto.com Arena. Halftime, Lakers 65 and the Cavs 56. The start of the third quarter is powered by ZipRecruiter, the number one rated hiring site based on G2 satisfaction ratings as of September 2023. Try ZipRecruiter for free at ZipRecruiter.com slash L.A. Michael, what jumped out at you about that first half? Well, Laker offense, man, just clicking. They're just uh, moving the ball very well. 15 assists off of those 25 makes. The, and their defense is pretty stellar, holding down uh, Garland and Mitchell to 21. They, uh, I said they got to hold them below 60. So, and so yeah, far, they are It almost over. feels like it should be up by more than nine, doesn't it? Exactly. But uh, the Cavs are hanging in there and... Uh, they should feel good about where they are down lead nine, and their best player hasn't even woken up yet, and Donovan Mitchell. All right, so the Cavs are going to have the ball to start the third quarter. Lakers send out D'Angelo Russell, Austin Reeves, Rui Hachimura, LeBron James, and Anthony Davis. Cavs have Darius Garland, Evan Mobley, Donovan Mitchell, Jared Allen, and Max Struess. Here's Mitchell with the ball. Top of the key. Mitchell to Jared Allen. Now to Donovan for three. No good. Rebound LeBron. Here come the Lakers for their first possession of the second half. LA leads by nine. Here's D'Angelo Russell. Dribbling top of the key. Goes left side to LeBron. Bounce pass. Anthony Davis. Left wing. Ten to shoot. Davis one on one against Jared Allen. Backing him in. Turn. Shoots. 15 foot fall away. Good. Tough shot by Anthony Davis to put the Lakers up 11, 67-56. Here is Darius Garland to Max Cruz to Evan Mobley on the left wing. Mobley to Donovan Mitchell. Mitchell behind the three-point line, bounce pass to Mobley, now to Jared Allen. Left Everybody hand left so the Lakers. By the Lakers out of bounds, and it'll be Cleveland. Did you hit the like button? Come and on, hit the like button. And subscribe too, join the family. The Cleveland only has six seconds to shoot it. Donovan Mitchell to bring it in, and Austin Reeves kicks it out of bounds. Now, that was a yeah, kick. See, that's a kick. Not when somebody throws the ball off a guy's, deflects the ball off a guy's leg, and he had no intention of kicking it. And the referee stopped playing anyway, said it's a kick ball. I don't understand that rule. So here's Darius Garland to bring it in. Gets it to Jared to Allen, back to Garland. Garland, three-pointer. Good. He's the one keeping the Cavs in the game. He's got 17 points because Mitchell hasn't shown up yet for, for Cleveland. Here's D'Angelo Russell dribbling just inside half court. Goes left side to LeBron. Behind the three-point line, LeBron threw it away. Evan Mobley steals it. Ahead to Garland on a run out. Blocked by LeBron. Wow. And LeBron might be hurt. He went flying into a cameraman, and he's down. The cameraman might be hurt. Yeah, that cameraman looks like he got the worst of it. LeBron flew in for a block, and now LeBron is actually helping the cameraman up. The cameraman's like 80 years old. He could have killed him. <laughs> and LeBron is trying to walk it off. He's got a pretty no Ooh, he slammed hard into the camera itself. His grandkids are calling, Grandpa, are you all right? 
the cameraman's okay. Just more concerned about his camera right and, now. And Donovan Mitchell's over there checking on Garland. So there's a bunch of injuries as a result of this play. Cameraman looks like Tim Conway or Captain Kangaroo. <laughs> well, those two guys don't look alike. <laughs> and a combination. He's got, the, <laughs> he's got the Captain Kangaroo here and Tim Conway face. Well. Garland's trying to walk it off. LeBron's trying to walk it off. The cameraman's back in position. Yeah, he's ready to go. The rest of the players ain't as tough as him. And, and uh, Garland and LeBron are both walking like Fred Sanford, exactly. you would say. Cameraman's telling these guys, man up, look at me. I'm ready to go, boys. And he took the worst of it. That was a beautiful block by LeBron. But a lot of casualties after it was over. All right, here comes Cleveland to inbound the ball. The Laker lead is eight. 67 to 59. Darius Garland has it out near half court. Garland to Max Cruz for three. Good. And you don't want to get him going. And all of a sudden, Michael, it's a five point game. 67 62. LeBron has it left side behind the three point line. LeBron thinking about a three, instead dribbles and dumps it into Anthony Davis on the left block. Davis working on Evan Mobley. Turn shoots a jump hook over Mobley, no good. Rebound Struce. And now Cleveland can cut this lead to three or maybe two. Here's Donovan Mitchell right to the rim. Got it to Jared Allen. Slam dunk. And the Lakers lead is just free. 67-64. Austin Reeves into the front court. Give it to D'Angelo Russell, working left. Russell to Hachimura. Hachimura, two-pointer. No good. Rebound Cleveland. They score here, will be a timeout. Here is Struce. Get the ball to Garland, he's the hot guy. Top of the key, Mitchell back to Struce. Down low to Mobley. Mobley with a mismatch. And throws the ball right to Jared Allen, and the Lakers block is dumb. Here comes LeBron the other way. Three on three. Reeves back to LeBron. Three pointer. In and out, no good. Lakers have gone cold. Here comes Donovan Mitchell. Mitchell into the front court. Mitchell back in into D'Angelo Russell. Mitchell gets free. Two pointer, no good. Rebound Hachimura ahead of LeBron. Laker lead is three, 67 64. They dump it into Anthony Davis and Got held. Mitchell was holding yep. him, and none of the three officials saw that. It's a turnover for the Lakers, their 10th. Here's Garland into the front court. Three pointer for the tie. It goes in. It rimmed out, went back in. Timeout, Lakers. 67 all. 8.39 remaining. Third quarter on the ESPN LA Lakers radio network. Every moment of the Lakers happens here. LeBron is still dazzling the crowd. LeBron 360, reversed it on the other side, and laid it in. 21 NBA seasons, and the Kings stand strong in the purple and gold. Wow! LeBron and the Lakers play here. I'm Just trying to make plays, and I uh, felt like that was the best way to kind of finish that one. On the ESPN LA Lakers radio network. Show your Lakers pride with the latest gear from LakersStore.com. Discover the, the latest must-haves. Come on, hit the like button. Apparel, to new Subscribe collaborations. Too. Plus the, the latest family. in Lakers jerseys and accessories. Start shopping now and rep your purple and gold in every occasion. The exclusive collections are about more than just merchandise. They're a statement. The range of t-shirts, hats, jerseys, sweatshirts, shorts, and more lets you express your Lakers loyalty in style. Grab your gear now at LakersStore.com. Lakers basketball is back. Kicks it to Austin Reeves. Three pointer by Reeves. It's good. Austin Reeves with a dagger. There I go. There I go. There I go. Follow the purple and gold on the journey to Banner 18. Look out. LeBron flying down the lane for a dunk. There I go. There I go. There I go. LeBron, AD, Austin Reeves, and a full cast of talent is a problem for the rest of the league. Vanderbilt volleyball to Russell, three-pointer. What a night! D'Angelo Russell! The Lake Show is back in business as one of the top contenders in the West. 
travel and gold play here on the ESPN LA Lakers radio network. LeBron to AD. AD to LeBron. journey to Banner 18 is on for the purple and gold. You are never too old for a family. The Dave Thomas Foundation for Adoption is dedicated to finding forever families for children who have been waiting in foster care the longest. Learn more at DaveThomasFoundation.org. Let's pause 10 seconds for station identification and the ESPN LA Lakers. Everybody, Radio let's Network. go Lakers. Did you hit the like button? Come on, hit the like button and subscribe too. Join the family. Lakers have the ball. The Cavs are on an 11 to 2 run and they've tied the game at 67. Here's Austin Reeves into the front court. Reeves dribbling, gets it to LeBron. LeBron dribbling, he loses it. Stolen by Darius Garland. Everything going the Cavs way here in the third. Garland dribbling. Garland down the middle, kicks it to Mobley. Mobley threw it away. Jared Allen had posted up and Mobley threw it into him, but Allen vacated the post and thought he was gonna shoot it. So that's a turnover for the Cavs. Each team has 11 turnovers. Each team has scored 13 off those turnovers. Here's D'Angelo Russell driving, throws the ball 14. away. 14 turnovers for the Lakers. Let's see if the Cavs will score off of that turnover to get the edge there. Yeah, that's only the 12th for the Lakers. Oh, that's right. Here is Garth. Hands the ball top of the key to Jared Allen. He gives it to Donovan Mitchell. Mitchell dribbling. Mitchell's still dribbling, and they found him. I think he was going up to shoot. Let's see if the ref thinks so. They're going to say the ball was still in, on the ground, so no shots. Donovan doesn't like it, but he's not going to win this argument. 67 all, 7.45 to go. Third quarter. Garland. There is Garland dribbling. It's a hot guy. Garland under the basket. Gave it to Mobley who drops it. Boy, it's turnover city. 12th turnover for Cleveland. Everything's tied. Turnovers, points off turnovers, the score. Close as you can get. Got more turnovers than Red Panda at halftime. <laughs> Dropped like seven bowls. Here's Austin Reeves to Hachimura. Traveling. And then well, another turnover. 13. There's still how many minutes left to, left to go in this game? 12, 19 minutes to play. 13 turnovers. They'll get to 20. Yeah, that's too many. It just it's a good team, that's for sure. Here is Donovan Mitchell driving, whips the ball out to Garland for three in the lead. No good. Rebound Anthony Davis. Gets it ahead to Austin Reeves. We've been tied at 67 for a while. Reeves driving toward the basket. Whips it to Russell. Three-pointer. No good. Nobody can buy a basket. Here's Darius Garland back to Max Struess. Three-pointer. No good again. Here's Reeves. Ahead to Hachimura. A beautiful pass. Slam dunk. Lakers by two. 69-67. And maybe more importantly, Michael, that ends a streak of four straight possessions turning the ball over. Here is Darius Garland driving on Austin Reeves. What a move. Lay it up and in. Yeah, he's quick. Very crafty with that quickness, too. Look, kind of go. Mini Kyrie Irving. Six and a half to go. Lakers turn it over again. Those active hands by the Cavs in the passing lanes. 14 Lakers turnovers, including five of the last six possessions. And what do we got here? Timeout Cleveland. We Cavs ball when we come back. Lakers 69, Cavs 69. 619 to go in the third on the ESPN LA Lakers radio network. A cabana and free play for booking a room? Don't
don't say anything or they'll sell out. Now your top reasons to visit Morongo. Book your Canyon View room now and get a Lazy River Cabana and 20 bucks in free play Monday through Thursday based on availability. Number two. Get a folding insulated cooler stool when you earn 500 points on your rewards card tonight. And the number one reason. R&B artists Drew Hill and Montel Jordan. Live April 19th. Morongo. Good times. Hey, it's Mace. Life may not always go as the playbook intended, but the L.A. County Department of Mental Health has got your back. If you ever feel anxious, overwhelmed, need immediate help, we're here for you with free emotional support, service referrals, and crisis counseling. Call our 24-7 helpline, 800-854-7771, or visit the Department of Mental Health website at dmh.lacounty.gov. Life is a team sport, and the L.A. County Department of Mental Health is here to support you every step of the way. Just as every point matters, every detail counts in our meticulously crafted vehicles. Experience luxury at the top of its game. Welcome to Cadillac of Beverly Hills, the number one Cadillac dealer in the Western region. Did you hit the, the like button? Year in a row. Come on, Come hit the and like button. The incredible and subscribe selection too. and Join pre owned vehicles today at our showroom. 8767 Wilshire Boulevard in Beverly Hills and at CadillacBeverlyHills.com. Here in California, we are all about chill. From hitting the beach or going on your favorite hike to going all out and pulling for our teams to win another championship. No one is more chill than us. The one thing, though, that ties us all together, enjoying all that California has to offer with great friends and a cold Coors Light. Pick up icy cold Coors Light today or even get it delivered to your door today. Visit CAChooseChill.com to learn more. 2024 Coors Brewing Company, Golden, Colorado. Celebrate responsibly. Breaking news from Pizza Hut, any medium pizza with any of your favorite toppings are all just 12 bucks. Any recipe, any toppings, any medium for $12. Order now on the Pizza Hut app or at PizzaHut.com. about the impact the Lakers are making in the community at Lakers community on X, Instagram, and Facebook. Get photos, recaps. Lakers working to be champions in the community. Who's in, who's out? Brought to you by In-N-Out Burger. That's what a hamburger's all about. For the Lakers, D'Angelo Russell out. Spencer Dinwiddie in. Cleveland has the ball in a tie game. Evan Mobley's got it. Top of the key, Donovan Mitchell for three, and the Cavs have the lead. That was a pure shot. Barely touched the rim when it went through. I mean, the net. You don't want to get Mitchell on track. He's four of ten, ten points, two of six from three. Here is LeBron on the left side. Drops it into Anthony Davis. Back to Austin Reeves for three. No good. Lakers couldn't miss from three in the first half. Now they can't make one. Here's Donovan Mitchell moving left. Mitchell to Struz. Struz down to Mobley. Foul and almost a bucket. Foul on Davis. Got a nice little pump fake by Mobley. When you go to LAX, check out what's going on at flylax.com. If the Lakers can come back and win this game, they would move into the eighth spot in the West. If they lose, they'll stay in ninth. Free throw by Evan Mobley is no good. Maybe it's that basket, Michael. I think it's a little off, maybe. Lakers couldn't make one in the first half, and now Cleveland misses their free throw. Second free throw good, 73-69. Cavaliers by four. Here's Austin Reeves out of the backcourt. What was once a 16-point lead is gone. And a 20-point swing the other way. LeBron for three, no good. Now all of a sudden, the Lakers can't make a shot. Here's Anthony Davis. He misses, got his own rebound, puts it up and in. 73-71, Cleveland by two. Here is Darius Garland driving. Goes to Max Struess, top of the key, LeBert, left side, Evan Mobley. Mobley goes right at AD, AD fouls him, and no basket. Wow, that should count. He was going up to captain. I'm surprised they didn't do that continuous. But they said no continuation. So he's side of bounds. Cavs are protesting that call. It was a slow developing play. 
Sometimes these referees are very inconsistent with their continuation calls or not. All right, Cleveland's going to take the ball side out of bounds. They lead by two. 73 71. They bring it into Darius Garland. Five minutes remaining in the third quarter. Garland to Struce for three. No good. Rebound, Jared Allen. Back to Evan Mobley. Now to Karis LeBert. LeBert driving. Throws the ball into the middle of the paint. It's picked up by Dinwiddie. Dinwiddie ahead to LeBron. LeBron head down, driving, throws it to Reeves, three-pointer, good. Lakers back in front, 74-73, L.A. Here's Darius Garland, dribbling left, two-pointer by Darius, no good. Rebound LeBron, here come the Lakers. LeBron down the middle, LeBron dribbling, LeBron pulls up, kick it to Austin Reeves, Reeves back to LeBron, LeBron to the rim and in. 76-73, Lakers by three. 4-10 remaining in the third. Garland, top of the key, Jared Allen almost throws it away, but Garland gets it, saves it, finds Struess. Struess to Mobley. 12-footer, no good, knocked out of bounds by Jared Allen. It'll go to the Lakers. George Niang in for Cleveland, Evan Mobley going out. 3.56 remaining third quarter. Here's Austin Reeves. Everybody, Into let's go Lakers. Did you hit the like button? Reeves. Come on, Reeves. hit the like button. And subscribe too. Join the family. Somehow saved it to Dinwiddie. Got it to AD who scores. I have no idea how Austin Reeves kept that ball in bounds, but he did, and the Laker lead is five. 78 73. Three and a half to go, third quarter. Evan Mobley, right side. Give it to Karis LeBert. LeBert down the middle. Darius Garland fouled. And Austin Reeves is furious with this call. Oh, definitely fouled him. The Cavs uh, thought that should have been continuation again. Reeves is saying that he hooked him. Should have been an offensive foul. And Mitchell is going to inbound it for Cleveland. He's out there with Karis LeBert, Sam Morrell, Jared Allen, and George Niang. The Lakers have Spencer Dinwiddie, Gabe Vincent, Anthony Davis, D'Angelo Russell, and Torian Prince. Here's Mitchell to bring it in. Got it to Jared Allen, jumped. Stolen by Russell. Ball ahead to Vincent, now to Davis. Davis down the middle, fouled. And it's gonna be two free throws coming for Anthony Davis. The foul on Sam Morrell. Ben Durant's gonna take your calls after the game at 877-710 ESPN post game show. Michael, uh, beg your pardon, that foul's not on Morrell, it's on Mitchell, his second. Here is Anthony Davis. Going to the free throw line where he missed his last two, but before that he made everything. He made 20 in a row. Now he's back on the making them again. First free throw, good. Good, made them both. Eighty to seventy-three, Lakers by seven. It's been a weird game. They've led by as many as sixteen. They've also trailed. Mitchell's ball goes off his foot, right to Morrell, now to Jared Allen. Jared Allen hands it back to Mitchell. Mitchell driving down the middle, alley oop to Allen. He couldn't get there. AD's got it now. Here come the Lakers, five on four. Torian Prince, three-pointer, good again! Torian Prince is four for four from three, five for five in the game. Lakers back up to a 10-point lead. 
Here is Karis LeVert driving down the middle. AD blocks it. Grabbed by Dinwiddie. Here come the Lakers. Five on four. Another three by Prince. No good. Finally missed one. Here is Donovan Mitchell into the front court. 2.25 remaining in the third. Karis LeVert dribbling left. LeVert back to Niang. George Niang driving. Stolen again by the Lakers. This time, give it uh, the steal to Gabe Vincent. He gives it to D'Angelo Russell, who brings it into the front court. Anthony Davis for three. It's good. And the Lakers are up by 13. Everybody, let's go, Lakers. Did you hit the like button? Come on, the hit third. the like Lakers button. 86. And subscribe, too. Cat Join the 73 family. On the ESPN LA Lakers radio network. Lakers basketball is back. Kicks it to Austin Reeves. Three-pointer by Reeves. It's good! Austin Reeves with a dagger! There I go. There I go. There I go. There I go. Follow the purple and gold on the journey to Banner 18. LeBron flying down the lane for a dunk. There I go. There I go. There I go. LeBron, AD, Austin Reeves, and a full cast of talent is a problem for the rest of the league. Vanderbilt volleyball to Russell, three-pointer. What a night! D'Angelo Russell! The Lake Show is back in business as one of the top contenders in the West. So let's get down to business. I don't got no time to play around The Purple and Gold play here on the ESPN LA Lakers radio network. LeBron to AD. AD to LeBron! Journey to Banner 18 is on for the purple and gold. Make a basketball driven by Southern California Hyundai dealers. It's your journey on every mile in a brand new Hyundai. Visit by Hyundai.com or Hyundai dealers. Michael, this has been a game of runs. When the half started, the Cavs went on a 17-4 run to tie the Lakers up. The Lakers are now on a 17-0 run to go up by 13. Lakers 86, Cavs 73. Cleveland has the ball. Donovan Mitchell dribbling out near half court. Mitchell with 10 to shoot. Dribbles left. Now moving right. Vincent's all over him. Mitchell to the rim, can't finish, and a late whistle. That was one of those, let's see if it goes in shots. And Mitchell can end the 17-0 run from the free throw line. So, Michael, the ratings the other night for the LSU-Iowa women's game yeah. made it the most watched women's basketball game of all time. Wow. More than 12 million viewers. Yeah. The ratings just came in for last night's game. The game between UConn and Iowa. Let me guess. So 12.9 viewers, I'm gonna guess 15 million. Just missed it, 14 and change. Wow. The new most watched women's game ever. So tomorrow will be a new record then, especially if it's competitive. Yeah, tomorrow at noon is that final game. I'm uh, afraid though, Carolina, as much as misses the second free throw, is so good that game tomorrow might be a blowout. By the way, Mitchell just missed both free throws, so the 17-0 run is still alive for the Lakers. And now here's a foul on Evan Mobley. Shoving Anthony Davis to the ground, and AD's holding his left uh, ankle. He's trying to walk it off, and he's going to stay in the game. And because it's the third foul on Mobley, J.B. Bickerstaff says he wants to challenge this, and they're not letting him for some reason. Why wouldn't they? You can never figure out what these referees when you get right, a well, lot of he, he, he elects not to. AD's got the ball, gives it back to D'Angelo Russell. Russell around a pick from Davis, dribbling left, throws it all the way across court to Torian Prince, driving and scoring. Prince has been excellent tonight. Six out of seven from the field. 16 points. 
has provided all the bench scoring. And there's that <laughs> dad bod George Niang hitting another three. Dad bod George. That should be his nickname. Makes Jared Dudley look like Arnold Schwarzenegger. Yeah, he does look like Jared a little bit he towards does. the end of his career. Here is Torian Prince driving. Prince in the paint. Oh. Sure did. And then he gets it deflected out of bounds. It'll be Laker ball with eight seconds on the shot clock. There's only 51 seconds remaining in the third quarter. The Laker lead is 12, 88 to 76. Gabe Vincent is going to inbound it. Brings it into D'Angelo Russell. Russell to Torian Prince. Prince, 15 foot follow away. Good again. Torian Prince has 18 points off the bench on seven of eight shooting, including four of five for three. He's the only bench player to score. Here is Morrell, no good on a long three. AD's got the rebound. Here he comes into the front court, almost loses it. Gets it to Vincent, now to Prince. Prince almost threw it away, but he gets it back. Prince is going to shoot it now. It's hot. Gets it to Gabe Vincent. Vincent driving baseline. Vincent 10 foot fall away. Needs a bounce, didn't get it. Rebound grabbed by Cleveland. Shot clock is off. Karis LeVert brings it into the front court. Laker lead is 14. Seven seconds remaining in the quarter. LeVert drives by D'Angelo Russell, runs into Anthony Davis, throws it up and in. Beautiful shot by LeVert. And that was good defense by Davis. He just made a tough shot. That means Lakers by 12 at the end of three. 90 to 78. Fourth quarter next on the ESPN LA Lakers radio network. Your gas light's on. We need to fill up. Gas around here is too expensive. Don't drive all over searching for the lowest prices. Just download the free Upside app and get cash back for every gallon of gas you buy. I've already made around 200 bucks. You can make that kind of cash back just for buying gas? I'm stopping now to download Upside and fill up my tank. Download the free Upside app to earn real cash back every time you buy gas. Cash out any time to your bank account, PayPal, or e-gift card. Download the free Upside app now and use promo code RADIO for an extra 25 cents per gallon cash back on your first fill up. That's promo code RADIO. Everyone knows Earl Hershiser has won numerous awards for his performance on the field. But off the field, he's a great humanitarian. A Participation may vary. Cannot be combined with any other offer or combo meal. Valid for product of equal or lesser value. Up 90 to 78. The game was tied at 67 with 8.15 in the third quarter. Lakers went on a 17 to 0 run. That's right, a 17 to 0 run. Anthony Davis had a big three in that third quarter to put him back on top. And how about Torian Prince having a great game? 18 points for Torian, 7 of 8 from the field. He's only missed one three pointer. He's knocked down four of them. Torian has all of the Lakers bench points. DeAndre Russell with 23, LeBron with 20. I'm sorry, LeBron with 15 and 10. Anthony Davis has 20. Lakers shooting 58% from the field, but they got him hold on to the ball. 14 turnovers have led to 16 points for the Cavs and the Lakers at the end of three. 90 to 78. If John you hit the like Michael button, take you home on come the on, hit the like button. Radio and subscribe Network. too. Join the family. It's the start of the fourth quarter. Lakers 90, Cavs 78. It's crunch time. Brought to you by BBGO, the official game day snack of the Lakers. If the Lakers can hang on, they lead by 12 as we go to the fourth. They'll move in to eighth place in the West. They bring the ball to LeBron, who brings it into the front court. LeBron, top of the key, D'Angelo Russell. Russell dribbling. Bounce pass to LeBron. LeBron alley-oop. Jackson Hayes slammed up. Perfectly executed alley-oop from LeBron to Jackson Hayes. The Laker lead now 14, 92-78. Here's Darius Garland coming back the other way for Cleveland. Left side, Donovan Mitchell. Mitchell for three. No good. Rebound, LeBron. Here come the Lakers into the front court. LeBron. 
Head down, pulls up, two-pointer, no good. Rebound Darius Garland, here he goes. Bounce pass to Levert. Levert to the rim, LeBron fouls him. They were not letting him have a layup, and Karis Levert will go to the line to shoot two. Event your game, day style. Check out LakersStore.com for the newest Laker fashion. Special merchandise is drop it, go Lakers. Here's Karis Levert to the free throw line. Levert played football and tennis growing up, Michael, just like you. He's also a great juggler. Wow. Can you juggle? Yeah, two balls, yeah. <laughs> you know what else he has in common with you? What's that? His favorite athlete in another sport is Usain Bolt. Oh, yeah. Oh, you're a track athlete. He's your kind of guy. If you're a track fan, you definitely miss Usain. Only one of those. 92 to 80. Lakers by 12. LeBron's got it at the top of the key. LeBert made both free throws. Here is LeBron, one-on-one -on -one against George Niang. Now Evan Mobley switches over to LeBron with five to shoot. LeBron goes right by Mobley and got to the rim, and they ran out of time. Gabe Vincent threw in a three, but it was too late. Shot clock violation. It blocked LeBron, but it looked like it hit his wrist. That away with a foul. All right, here comes Cleveland, trailing by 12. One minute gone, fourth quarter. Here is Garland, stripped by Gabe Vincent, but he got it to Mobley, and they block him, but now a foul. Evan Mobley will go to the free throw line to shoot two. Wow. Like a basketball, presented by In-N-Out Burger. And In-N-Out Fresh is what it's all about. Michael, as I look at Evan Mobley, and I love his game, his brother Isaiah's on the Cavs, too. They both went to USC. He's only 22 years old. Does he need to get bigger? No, he needs to be He's more. He's very skinny. No, he needs to be more aggressive. Just uh, floats around too much. He's got if you four points. If you were coaching him, you wouldn't tell him to get in the weight room? Yeah, he's, he's never going to turn into the lawn until morning. It's always going to be long and lanky. So he just needs to, he's got skills just to be more, more assertive on offense. He's taken four shots today. He made the first free throw. Here comes the second one that would make it a 10 point lead. Let's see, let's see, Evan, you gotta, you gotta give me 12 to 15 shots every game. Here comes Donovan Mitchell into the front court. Guarding D'Angelo Russell. Russell got to the rim and throws it up and in. Nice game for D'Lo, he's got 25. He's the leading scorer in the game for either team. Here's LeBert down the middle, throws it away. Grabbed by Niang, Niang got to the rim and put it up and in. Boy, he's got that old man game, Michael, but it works. Yeah. Never seems to be in a hurry. Looks like another Luka Doncic out there. Here is Gabe Vincent. Dribbles around a pick from LeBron. Vincent into the paint, teardrop. Grabbed by Jackson Hayes and dumped. Vincent's shot was blocked. Hayes flew in, grabbed it out of the air, and dunked it. Evan Mobley, top of the key. Give it to Lavert. Lavert moving right. Lavert to Niang. Three pointer. No good. Rebound, Jackson Hayes. Gets it to D'Angelo Russell. Russell behind the three point line. Hook pass to. Vincent, now to Torian Prince, back to Russell, 30-footer good. And Russell sticks his arms out as if to say, are you not entertained? Here's Garland to the rim, can't finish. Rebound, D'Angelo Russell. Laker lead is 15. Russell, another three. Oh, he almost made another one. That would have brought the house down. Here's Mitchell coming back the other way for Cleveland. Got it to LeBert, three-pointer, good. 99-87, exactly nine minutes remaining in the fourth. Here is LeBron, top of the key. LeBron guarded by Mobley. 10 seconds to shoot. LeBron sizing Mobley up, triples left, gets to the paint, loses it, got it back, got it to Russell, three-pointer. No good, rebound Niang. Here come the Cavs. Garland into the front court. Beautiful pass to LeBert. Lay it up and in. Timeout, Lakers. Laker lead is 10. Los Angeles 99, Cleveland 89. On the ESPN LA Lakers radio network. 
John Ireland here. I want to talk about a brand I personally love. Travis Matthew products are crafted to make you look and feel your best no matter the activity. Travis Matthew has welcomed Austin Reeves to the family as an official brand ambassador. When he's not sinking threes, you'll catch him perfecting his golf swing. Head to TravisMatthew.com where all new customers receive 20% off their first order with code ESPN20. Offer valid online only. That's TravisMatthew.com. Use code ESPN20. Don't miss Trav and Sleek. Back Monday morning at 10 a.m. It's the Mid-Morning Spectacular. Yeah. The Mid-Morning Spectacular. Mmm. <laughs> Give us a couple raw ones so we have it. Mmm. One more. That was a little long. That was long. I like yeah. the one. Mmm. Oh, that was a good one. That was a good, good, good one. You know how they all do like, uh, you know, good afternoon, good afternoon. We can all just go, mmm. <laughs> Trav and Sleek. Weekdays after Unsportsmanlike. On 710 ESPN. Your Toyota dealer's got just the thing for spring. Great offers on the Toyota car, truck, or SUV that's just right for you. So now's the time to check out a stylish new Camry, powerful new Tundra, or versatile new RAV4. But here's the thing, spring will be gone before you know it. So don't wait, see your Toyota dealer today. We make it easy. Toyota, let's go places. Deciding to get a new car is a big deal. And deciding on the right new car that fits your lifestyle and budget is an even bigger deal. Fortunately, there's Toyota.com, where you can check out the latest offers on any new Toyota, search inventory, and locate a dealer. So to find the best deal on the Toyota that's just right for you, visit Toyota.com. We make it easy on you. Toyota, let's go places. Mason in Ireland. Well, you're not good at accepting feedback. That's right. Oh, no. Feedback is my friend. I either take it or ignore it. <laughs> Monday at 1 p.m. On 710 ESPN. Up in the locker room report, Better Durant's going to announce the game change of the night, powered by Vaveline Instant Oil Change. Beto's going to have a lot of choices tonight. Oh, it's going to be D'Angelo Russell. Russell's been hot, but what about Torian Prince? Oh, yeah. Everybody, Everybody let's right. go Lakers. Points off the bench. It could be him. And LeBron's having a nice game. Did you hit the like button? Come on, assists. hit the like button. And, and subscribe, too. To Join the family. Rebounds in the last eight minutes. Here he goes to the rim, LeBron, and he's fouled. And he's slow to get up, but I think he's okay. Let's see who they call this on. It's on George Niang. Niang and LeBron have like opposite bodies. Yeah. LeBron, LeBron might have the Before best, and after. Yeah, might have the best body in the NBA. And Niang might have the worst. <laughs> before and after ads. Maybe they could do a podcast together and call it that before and after. <laughs> Did you see the other day, LeBron has a podcast with J.J. Redick, and he made the first free throw. Second free throw, good. Laker now lead by 12, 101-89. LeBron said that in Miami, when they won their first title, what opened things up for them was that Eric Spolster, their coach, remember they lost to Dallas the yeah. first year they went to the finals? Said Eric Spolster, the coach, went to football practice at the University of Oregon and learned the spread offense from Chip Kelly. Oh, interesting. And here is a beautiful shot by Evan Mobley, laying up and in. And he said when he came back to Miami, he put Chris Bosh in the corner, spread the floor, and it opened everything up for LeBron and Dwayne Wade, and they were off and running. So those two guys on the open floor. Right. Two of the greatest players ever doing that. So that's what, uh, funny that that's what opened it up for him. Here is Austin Reeves throwing it away. Reeves now has to get back on defense. Darius Garland to the rim. Can't finish. Beautiful defense by Austin. Here's LeBron on the other end. Lay it up and in. That was all Austin Reeves saving the day by getting back on defense, and the Lakers get an easy basket out of it. Definitely gave up on the plate. 103 to 91, 720 remaining. Lakers by 12. Garland got to the rim, lay it up and in. Boy, he's crafty. Yeah, sure he is. 103-93, Lakers by 10 as we hit the seven minute mark. AD and Rui are at the scorer's table and now what are they gonna call an offensive foul on the Lakers? 
Eight screen, eight screen call on Jackson Hayes. A little bit of a flop action there by Garland when he went around the screen. Here come the Cavs, 103 to 93. Donovan Mitchell's got it. Mitchell step back, three pointer, no good. Rebound Hachimura, got it to LeBron. LeBron into the front court. Gives the top of the key, Anthony Davis. Davis back to LeBron, right side, behind the three point line, 10 to shoot. LeBron dribbles into the two point area. LeBron one-on-one -on -one against Mitchell. Two All-Stars going head-to-head. -head. LeBron gets it knocked out of bounds by Mitchell. And now the Lakers will have it, Michael, but only have 2.4 to shoot. That's plenty of time to get a shot off. Some kind of a screen and pull up and shoot, shoot a jump shot. Let's see if you're right. LeBron into Rui. Rui takes a three. No good, but AD cleans it up and lays it in. And you're starting to think that the Cavs are running out of time. 105-93, Lakers by 12. 6.15 to go in the fourth. Mitchell throws it away out of bounds. Yeah, time Doesn't this feel out. like the game's getting away from them? One more basket and one more stop, and the game is over. Here comes. Mainly because Mitchell has been non-factor today for Cleveland. Austin Reeves, yeah, we both love Mitchell, but this hasn't been his best game. Here is LeBron, 4-3. No good, rebound, A.D. Up high to get it. And he dribbles out of trouble in the corner. Throws it to a cutting LeBron who lays it up and in. Timeout, Cleveland. Lakers lead by 14. 107 to 93. Everybody let's go to Lakers. Go in the fourth on the ESPN LA Lakers radio network. Valvoline Instant Oil Change. Hit the like button. 15 minute try to oil hit the change. like button. Proud sponsor Subscribe to ESPN LA Lakers Radio Network. For over 30 years, Valvoline Instant Oil Change has provided quick, convenient main and services for busy people like you. Oil changes, tire rotations, transmission care, and more. Drive in to your neighborhood Valvoline and let the expert technicians make sure your ride is in peak performance in about 15 minutes. Visit SoCalOilChange.com for locations and game winning coupons. Every moment of the Lakers happens here. LeBron is still dazzling the crowd. LeBron 360, reversed it on the other side, and laid it in. 21 NBA seasons, and the Kings stand strong in the purple and gold. Wow! LeBron and the Lakers play here. Just trying to make plays, and I uh, felt like that was the best way to kind of finish that one. On the ESPN LA Lakers radio network. Fans, the NBA playoffs are on their way. Oh! But before they begin, it's the SoFi NBA Play-In Tournament. Winner advances, the loser goes home. Eight teams vying for the last two spots in each conference. Hurry! Some teams will get in. Do or die. Others, Shake. they're coming up short. Forget about that kid and Who wants it more? It's now or never. The playoffs are calling. But first, you got to win to get in. The SoFi NBA Play-In Tournament, April 16th through 19th on ESPN and TNT. Attention Lakers Nation. Are you ready to experience the game like never before? Download the Lakers app presented by BBGo. It's more than an app. It's your all access pass to player content, behind the scenes video and game highlights. Enjoy features like wallpapers, keepsakes, and play games with friends in the exciting Lakers arcade. Engage in predictive games, trivia, and bingo. Tailor made for the dedicated Lakers fan. Stay connected with the purple and gold and get the Lakers app for free on any device. Your home of Lakers basketball this season. Hachimura steals it. Falls on the ground. Picked up by Christian Wood. Outlet to LeBron. LeBron to Reeves. Reeves to the rim. Lakers lead. The ESPN LA Lakers Radio Network. John Ireland, Michael Thompson with you at Crypto.com Arena. Lakers 107, Cavs 93. If the Lakers can hang on, they would move to eighth in the West. And that's significant 
because if you're in the 7-8 play-in game, you only need to win once. If you're in the 9-10 play-in game, you need to win twice to get into the playoffs. So Lakers have been chipping away for a long time, and they would actually move up a spot if they could hang on today. Here is Mitchell to Garland. Garland driving down the middle. What a move by Garland, blocked by AD. Boy, Davis defensively has just been excellent tonight. Here's Austin Reeves moving right. Got it to AD. Alley-oop to LeBron. Slam dunk. And that's the exclamation point. Lakers 109, Cavs 93. And I think Darvin Michael can start. He doesn't have to write this second, but can start taking the starters out. Here's a foul on the Lakers. Or with 5.05 remaining, is there too much time left? Yeah, up 16 with five minutes. I'll give him another couple of minutes if they hold on to the lead around a three minute mark and I start taking it. well coaches are so overly cautious about that though they, they probably well, remember the, the Lakers were 19 down in Milwaukee with eight and a half to go and they came back at one here is Garland running into the key boy he's good he's got 26 points but he's taken 22 shots to get those 26 so that's not that impressive you know he has not shot a free throw all game look at this you ever see that before? Yeah. AD and LeBron were like offensive linemen blocking for Austin Reeves, who didn't want to run the ball, so they didn't run clock. The only thing I don't get about that is the Lakers want the clock to run, don't they? They're ahead. Here's Austin Reeves, threw it away, threw it to Mitchell. Here comes Max Struess, Struess to Garland. I've seen a lot of quick threes. Garland trying to shake Austin Reeves. Reeves now picks up Struess. Struess throws it outside to Mobley. Three-pointer by Mobley is short. Rebound Hachimura. Now, if I'm the Lakers, I run some clock on these possessions, don't you? Timeout, Lakers. I think that's what Darvin's going to tell them. 4.02 to go in the fourth. Lakers 109, Cavs 95. On the ESPN LA Lakers radio network. Lakers basketball is back. Kicks it to Austin Reeves. Three-pointer by Reeves. It's good! Austin Reeves with a dagger! Follow the purple and gold on the journey to Banner 18. Look out! LeBron flying down the lane for a dunk. There I go. There I go. There I go. LeBron, AD, Austin Reeves, and a full cast of talent is a problem for the rest of the league. Vanderbilt volleyball to Russell, three-pointer. What a night! D'Angelo Russell! The Lake Show is back in business as one of the top contenders in the West. So let's get down to business. I don't want to play around The Purple and Gold play here Everybody, let's on ESPN go Lakers. Lakers Radio Network. LeBron to AD. AD to LeBron. Did you hit the like button? Come on, hit the like button. Subscribe to join the family. The journey to Banner 18 is on for the purple and gold. John Ireland, Michael Thompson, 402 remaining in the fourth. Lakers 109, Cavs 95. For now, Michael, all the Lakers starters are still in there. With the exception of D'Angelo Russell. Spencer Dinwiddie's in for him. Here is Austin Reeves dribbling at the top of the key. Reeves to LeBron. LeBron to Dinwiddie. Dinwiddie for three. Good. 112 to 95. And now, I think you can pull him, don't you? Yeah, 17 point lead with three minutes to go, sure. Here is Max Cruz. Flying down the middle, bounce pass, Karis LeBert. LeBert to the paint, shoots it over AD and in. Now here the Lakers are doing it again. They bring the ball in, but they don't pick it up until the Cavs come in the back. Michael, with the lead, why would you want to run save time on the clock? Well, the clock's not going to start until the ball's touched anyway. LeBron at the rim, can't finish, but he's fouled. And J.B. Bickerstaff is livid. I think he's probably going to use his challenge here. The fouls on Jared Allen. Or maybe Bickerstaff feels like the game's over. 
He just shook his head in disgust. Oh, no, no, he's got a hope that his team has the rest of the day in L.A. and they will uh, use up all the energy away from the court tonight. They, they got to be back here, Michael, tomorrow for a 12:30 game against the Clippers. How about how about Crypto.com Arena this weekend? So today we have a Laker Day game and a Kings hockey game tonight. Wow. Tomorrow a Clippers Day game and a Laker night game. Oh. They have to reconfigure this place four times in two days. These guys, uh, these maintenance workers around there, they're used to doing that, so they've got it down to a science. LeBron makes one of two, and the Laker lead is 16. Here is Karis LeVert in front of the paint. Almost lost it, throws it out to Darius Garland. We're inside three minutes now. Garland dribbling on the baseline, makes a beautiful ball fake, and finger rolls it and missed it. Anthony Davis has another rebound, his 11, to go along with 22 points. Here's Dinwiddie into the front court. Dinwiddie dribbling on the baseline, goes underneath the hoop. Three-pointer for Rui, no good. Rebound Jared Allen. Everybody, let's go Lakers. Here's the got it up the right side. Here's Mitchell for three. No good. Rebound Anthony Davis. Donovan Mitchell, 10 points today. 4 of 12 shooting. Could be that four, 4 of 13 after that miss. That's right. Probably was a main start of the game. You could hold him to 10 points. Here is LeBron on the left wing. Drive toward the basket. Trapped underneath. Throws it away. Darius Garland's got it. Three-pointer by Garland, no good. Rebound Struess, back to Garland. Another three, no good. Rebound AD. Call a timeout to get these guys out of the game. Yeah, that's what I'd do. Jeez. Well, just throw the ball out of bounds, whatever. Spencer Dinwiddie dribbles it into the front court. I mean, just throw the ball out of bounds. Well, take a shot clock violation. And now Cleveland fouls. Cleveland wants to get their players out, too. 133 remaining. All right, everybody out. Reeves, LeBron, Hachimura, AD. Dinwiddie will stay in the game with Max Christie. Maxwell Lewis. Did you hit the like Dorian button? Prince Come on, Jackson hit the like button and subscribe too. Join the family. Lakers ninth win in ten games, and finally, they're going to move up in the standings. So the ninth eight? to eight. Wow, how about that? We got a chance to get the seven still, right? Well, they, yeah, absolutely. Here is a baked in three pointer by Dinwiddie. He had to shoot it to beat the shot clock. And it went in, 116-97, to 97, 110 to go in the game. And now the Cavs throw it away. Lakers can take a couple of shot clock violations that they just want to conserve energy. Colin Castleton coming in. Who's coming out? Dinwiddie comes out, so Castleton's in there. Here is Max Christie dribbling. Christie at the free throw line. Bounce pass to Jackson Hayes, handed to Torian Prince. Prince has been unbelievable tonight. Runner no good. Rebound Castleton. Give it to Christie. Christie with nine seconds to shoot it. Three pointer by Max. In and out. No good. Morell's got it. Gets the ball into the front court. And now a step out of bounds. Uh, some cap player out there. <laughs> I don't know who that is. You know who that is, who Michael? Is that? that is Larry Nance's younger oh, brother, I stand Pete corrected. Nance. That's right. Who plays for the Cavs. I've heard of him before, yeah. It's good to see him out there. And he just got called for a travel, but... Larry's a great guy, and he, he was in high school when Larry That's played right. for us. Then he went to Northwestern and played for four years, and because of COVID, he was able to play a fifth year. 
Well, he's built like his dad. I hope he gets a chance to play. All right, shot clock violation of the Lakers. Only five seconds remaining. Did you hit the like button? And the Come on, the hit the like now. button. And Lakers subscribe too. Everybody, let's go, Lakers. And Michael, the Lakers have finally moved into eighth place. So this, if the play in started today, they will play the Suns? No. If the, the season Pelicans. ended today, they would be the eight and they would play. The Pelicans. Oh, the Pelicans, wow. And that would be without Brandon Ingram. And Zion. No, They're, Zion will be back by then, I think. Yeah, but Zion hasn't played in the last right. two games yeah. and may not play again. They've lost four in a row. Yeah, so the Pelicans. Well, if, it has, if that's the way it holds up, we'd like to go to New Orleans. That's a good hotel with great food. But it's still a long, still four, what, four more games to go? No, five more games to go? Four. Four more. Yep. So they got time. Two to, here, two on the road. So if they win out, they got a tough game tomorrow. And then of the, the Warriors will be in here with still a lot to play for. Got to catch the Lakers, but to keep to make sure Houston doesn't catch them. That's final. All right, we are waiting to uh, to talk to Torian Prince, who was fantastic tonight. Seven out of nine, four of five from three, and Torian is throwing on the headset so torian can you hear us yeah i can hear y'all hey man congratulations i don't even know if you know this do you know that you just moved into eighth place in the west no i didn't thank you for the information <laughs> yeah sacramento lost in boston last night so you guys are a half game up on the kings you're in eighth they're in ninth that's good to know man yeah, and and it's also the ninth time in 10 games Torian, you were seven of nine from the field and four of five from three. Do you know early in a game whether or not you're on, or does, is each game different? No, each game is different. Obviously, today is super different being at 12:30. Um, everybody knows I'm I'm uh, going through Ramadan right now and uh, not having anything to eat or drink through this moment um, was something that I haven't felt since since starting Ramadan, but um, it was a good experience. So. I, I, when I was a player, we used to play afternoon games. I always preferred to play in the afternoon. Is that the way you guys feel too? Uh, I don't mind when we play. It, uh, every time every time comes with different challenges, so I'm just blessed to be able to wake up today and do what I love. Why were you guys to, to be able to do such a good job on Donovan Mitchell today? Uh, I, to be honest, he wasn't even really our focal point. They have uh, other great guards as far as Karras and DG, um, so we, we, we thought of them as a collective and what we could do uh, as a team to make them do what we didn't want them to do. And I think we did a good job of that. Uh, Torian, you mentioned that you uh, honor Ramadan, and there's a handful of players. Hakeem Olajuwon used to do it. Kyrie Irving does it. You obviously do it. Are you allowed to drink just water, or can you can you uh, drink Gatorade, or how does it work? Uh, absolutely nothing from sun up to sundown. Um, just water. Absolutely nothing. No nothing. water from sun up to sundown. The most I do is brush my teeth in the morning, and. Um, that's about it, man. Man, that's great willpower. Good for you. Yeah, 100%. All praise be to Allah. Uh, now, tomorrow, here comes Minnesota, the team with the number one record in the West. They're very good, Torian. You've had great battles with them all year long. What do you got to do to slow down Anthony Edwards and the T-Wolves? Oh, man, it's a collective thing. It's no one man. Um, we have principles on the front side of what he sees, and then obviously when they get to the second actions of uh, when, we, when we make things difficult for him, we have something for that too. So just flying around, knowing our personnel, knowing what we want to force guys to do and, um, and living with the results. Well, thank you for the visit. Happy Ramadan, and congrats on the win. Thank you, brother. I appreciate that. All right, there's Torian Prince, and the Lakers Damn. win it. How does he do that? No water now until sundown after From spending sun up all to that sundown, energy? yeah. That is, that's, I don't understand how it's even physically possible. You remember when Kyrie hit that running left-handed uh, shot to win a game earlier this season. It was a oh yeah yeah over Denver. That he he was sell, he was honoring Ramadan during that. He hadn't eaten or drank all day, and he was able to hit that big shot. Uh, Beto Duran joins us now. Beto, it took a while. The Lakers have won nine out of ten, but not until five minutes ago have they moved up at all in the standings. They now move to eighth. They've got to stay ahead of Sacramento since Sacramento has the tiebreaker. But we've been waiting so long to move up. We'll take anything, right? Yeah, the Lakers went four in a row, and they've been playing such good basketball the last couple of weeks. But because nobody else was losing, it was hard to really say, okay, they're playing good. But this game was fun, game of runs, and they get the victory. I like yeah, it. Yeah, man. Michael, when right. you look 
at Minnesota coming in here tomorrow night. Yeah. That's one of the your former Tough stomping game. grounds. Yeah. They're really good. No towns, though. Yeah, but they have Gobert. They didn't have Gobert the last time we played them. What, just give me a thought on taking on second day of a back-to-back, -back, a really good Minnesota team. Well, well, without towns, Minnesota's not as formidable, but they know they're going to have to be at their best, especially if Anthony Edwards has one of those Anthony Edwards All-NBA games. So, but they... With a good team like Minnesota coming in, that's good for Darvin Ham and the Lakers. That's going to keep them focused. All right, folks, four games left. Minnesota tomorrow, Golden State Tuesday, then we hit the road. Memphis next Friday, New Orleans next Sunday, and Beto, that's it. Four games.